Hello, everybody. Welcome to Don't Make Us Bored, Brosentia and Corn Dan's variety show. Brosentia here, getting ready for some chess, zess. Shh. I don't know. I don't. I don't know how to say. It. Hey, Corn Dan. Hi. Hey, how was your vacay? It was good. Well, good. Okay. I got away from everybody for a while, except by getting away with everybody. I meant. Are getting away from everybody i mean i really got stuck with a whole bunch of people um because okay. my whole family showed up to s visit my parents oh is so it, we showed up good? and my brother yeah it was good and my brother showed okay. up and my brother-in-law and his new wife and and their kids and everybody showed up and there were a lot of people in in this and it, and it was it was good but it was definitely very very busy Okay, yeah, I can imagine it would be a little bit busy, but I'm glad that you had fun. I'm glad that, like, you got to spend time with important relatives and such. And mostly that you got to get away from work for a little while. We all need that from time to time. I did get away from work for a little while, and that was really nice. Oh, speaking of work, everybody, I'm probably... It looks like I have been accepted back to writing some articles. What articles? Well, y'all remember... What What do y'all remember? Oh, yeah, the, the uh, weird articles that I was writing about weird games. Uh, I'm going to be writing those again now that I'm not teaching for officially. I will... Hat. Like, I definitely have more time to do stuff, and I'm gonna be doing that, so get excited! Uh, and thank you again to the peeps over at PC Invasion, uh, aka, uh, Faizu's friends. Friends? True. I don't know. Subordinates? Something like that. Yeah! That'll be a lot of fun. I get to write, and I will I will share all of those for everybody. Oh crap! I am not streaming Phasmophobia. Oh my god! It could be. Yeah. Hey, Flannel Cat. We could we could play Phasmophobia. I mean, not what I signed up for, but sure. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean, I'm always in for Phasmophobia. Like you know me. Well, when I'm home or not on a date or actually around. Yeah, I know you. Oh my gosh, we had some really good runs this last weekend. Uh, we got two runs, uh, I think under 40 minutes. One was a trio, one Ooh. was a duo. It's getting really good. Oh yeah, no, we're... I, I was so proud to be part of like the first completed run, and now it sounds like we're getting more consistent, which is yeah. awesome. Uh, what's cool as well is the NPC showed up and helped with those. It was great right. to have him along. Like, he, he had never played Phasmophobia before. First time really playing was during a speed run. And yep. <laughs> I was in that game. It was pretty good. It, it was so good. <laughs> yeah. So how are you doing? You know, you... Press. Are you... <laughs> you're what? Press. <laughs> oh. You know. Oh, okay. We're, we're trying to buy a house, and it's been a real pain, to say the least. Yeah, well, you know, not a buyer's market. No, uh, we are. So we're, we're my wife and I are down in uh, North Carolina for a month. We've picked up an Airbnb for a month and we're trying to find a place to buy. And it has been a lot of like, this is a strong offer, except someone else came in and offered more than that in cash. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds yeah. about right. Honestly, uh, it that's a sucky situation. <laughs> yeah. So good, good luck. Good luck. Uh, Thank you. I see uh, some chess <laughs> on screen, sort of. See some zess on on the screen, the zess. video game screen. So you gotta you gotta pick a username if you haven't done that already. Oh oh oh! I've not done that. Uh, randomized username dusk <laughs> equals after. You get nine re-rolls, so as soon as you see something that really speaks to you... Okay, let's see. What do we got? Ooh, rain taste. I kind of like rain that. Rain taste. Rain taste. <laughs> it sounds like a weird vaporwave knockoff. I know, you could have I... one of the ones that showed up on mine. Mrs. The Husk. 
Mrs. the Husk, Milkwing. With four Ew. exclamation. XXX Fair Jump. Okay. Ah, uh, I should have gone with no uh reroll. Bat Angel Heart. <laughs> Bat Angel. I got some I got some good choices that here. Juice. I got King Weird. King Weird. Okay. So every every time you start, do you get to choose a new username? Uh, you pick one and that's it. That's your username forever now. Oh, well, apparently that equals juice is my name. <laughs> I love that equals juice. It's pretty <laughs> good. <laughs> All right, so this is a one-on-one -on -one game. I will happily play with you. You can play with Corn Dan. We can all we can do all sorts of nonsense today. This is okay. the excitement of Zest today. And then you know you can gong me anytime in the hour to be like, all right, we've played enough video games. We're moving on. Yeah, we're we'll see how long this goes. Honestly, I'm very excited to play some Zest, some right. chess. That right, equals well, hit, juice. Hit host game. I'll join and uh, don't click. And a ban at the bottom, unless you want boobs on your stream. Uh, I don't today. All uh, right. Everybody, we might. Which one is the boob one that I don't click? Okay, so you see the uh, the girl with the red hair and like the gray skin in the bottom right? Yeah, that's the one. Okay, that that's like it's not bad. It's, it's really boobs, though. I mean, it's tasteful. It's very tasteful, but. Okay, everybody, we may end up getting tasteful nudity at some point, but until then, you better choose your character. Okay, oh there's a timeout. Uh, you gotta go, you I'm gotta trying, go. I'm trying to? <laughs> I'm clicking on the screen and nothing happened? Uh-oh, disconnected. Timeout. Ah, uh, well. Did I break everything? Now I'm just at a disconnected screen. Okay, let me try this again. Do I have to close the game? I... I did. <laughs> I okay. don't know. Do, 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 launch. Let's hope it opens up in the same area. Yay! Okay, online. Host. Come join your juice, friend. The select oh, I hear audio. Okay, I'm going with whatever this and is. And nothing's happening. Okay, now. Oh, oh, I had to click OK. Oh, you had to pick first. I got it. We'll go with Weird. Mazarin. So now you get to pick a relic. These well, are two click other okay. pieces. Oh I, I, oh, I have to pick a relic. Okay, these are the relics are two other pieces. Okay, now it says you're picking. Okay, uh, there are two other pieces. Dragon. Yeah, that sit on your board that do things. It's like. Oh, okay. We'll go with flowers. Sure. I like flowers. They're neat. Okay. All right, so, what are you looking at here? This is this is. Oh God! You pick the race that's all the same thing. I love it. Oh geez. Well, okay, we can do this. Oh, you're first. Yep. Uh, so all of those pieces move the same, but when they capture other pieces, they evolve into other stuff depending on. Uh, you can either kill an enemy or get a shogi upgrade, which is enter. I think uh, the other side of the board. Like you would upgrade a regular shogi piece. Gotcha. Uh, do I have like a masterpiece here or do you have to kill all of them? You don't have a masterpiece. I have to kill all of those. I can kill your main character, though. And yeah, you fine. can. You can kill Mazarin. Mazarin has two hit points, though. OK, what what are these orbs that drop? That's my question. Uh, the orbs are mana, which you can use to cast spells. Okay. Your spells are in the bottom left corner. If you click on them once, they'll tell you what they do. Two of them are based off your character, and two of them are based off the extra pieces that you brought. I am very bad at this, and I did not refamiliarize myself with characters, but I don't ah, know. Ah, very nice. Yeah. Eh, that's fine. Okay. I'm bringing no, out nature. Wait, you click on your character to cast a spell? At the bottom left corner, there's the spells. No, I believe you just double click on it, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, okay. I could be wrong. I have no... Sp I do not have enough mana for spells. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Let's see. What does this do? <laughs> nice. And so the piece in the middle, uh, like the earth-looking thing, that is... Uh, if you have a piece on that, you start to gain a bar at the top uh, or at the bottom on my case. And that's how you get like a uh, kind of like a not a diplomatic victory, but a diplomatic victory where you just conquer the opponent. So you can't just run around the board and hide the whole time. 
Okay, gotcha. How could you? Oh no, you've got the angry three-pronged one now too. Yeah, I don't know oh, what wait, that means. Can... But I sure do. Oh, good job. You zap me. You got... You zipping, you zapping, you zopping, you doing all that. So the, the big fire pieces have ranged attacks, which are a lot to deal with. Yeah, I've... I fought this character during... I, I played one game of this uh, before the stream so that I could, like, figure out what the crap I was doing. You he know? did more than I did. <laughs> I can't even move forward. I can do that. Let's go. So the, the usually the direction the fire is like the fire, the flame burst right that moves right and forward, but it only attacks to the right. Um, I don't love your flower. Yeah, I didn't imagine you would. And plus, if you have your leader on the uh. Like each piece has a capture rate. Yeah. And that's how quickly you capture the uh, the planet in the middle. Ah. Okay, nice job. Little little flame so there. One of your spells automatically evolves something and the other one just duplicates a drone. So your your perks there are like, I'm going to be an overwhelming force of sorts. Okay, uh Let's see, you turn a Gaia head into a Gaia... Turn a Gaia wing into a Gaia head. What? Uh, sure. Oh, the, uh, the Gaia stuff? Uh, that is your, your extra pieces that you brought. I'm not sure what a wing and a head mm. is, but that's a Gaia head right there. A Gaia wing might be... Uh, I'm not sure, but... Oh, can't do a lot to that. Why? How could you? Hmm. I'm sorry. Sorry that I'm so cool. Mm-hmm. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do. Apparently you got some victory points for that. Oh, really? Okay. Mm hmm I'm egg. Oh no. Bad? Help me? I don't know what egg means. What does egg do? You'll be able to fly and go over pieces soon ah, with the egg thing. I'm ready for egg. Yeah, this is, this is, there's a lot going on in this. Oh yes. <clears throat> what can my egg do? Nothing. Okay, that's fine. I don't need Egg to do anything, okay? Yep. Egg, go ahead and live your best life. Egg should eat. It be your best lives. So now Egg has a tremendous eat. amount of spots, but is has a weakness to things near it. Uh, sort of. That's right, run away. Just a little bit, you know, just the right amount. Look, it's it's excess, you know. You gotta you gotta be a strategic master, okay? Oh, absolutely, like master of the art. Why is there a combat. mahjong piece there? Uh, that's that's one of uh my bonus pieces that I brought with me. It was a mahjong piece. Oh, I think I, I think I made a bad move. No, I didn't. I made a great move. Don't worry. Shoot, does that move me there? No. Oh, nice. Okay. Mazarin appears very aggressive, but I'm very bad at playing Mazarin. But I think she's like the character I want to get good at. Gotcha. Hmm. I don't trust your fun flying friend at all. Why not? They're fun. <laughs> and they fly. Hmm. 
Well, I can't shoot that. God, and you've got that protected too. Uh -huh. You're making me scared. Uh oh, I'm in check. Oh, and there is no like checkmate protection. If you're in check and you don't do anything about it, then you, you die. die. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> However, you have an extra HP, so it's not like the biggest problem in the world. Okay. Yeah. The extra hit point, I always forget about it, and things end up a little weird sometimes. Ah. Oh, wait. Huzzah. Thank you. Eh. I have a candle. <clears throat> I am okay with this. Okay. 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 Interesting. Yeah. Well, I don't like that. What did you? I turned one do? of my flame bursts into a flame arrow. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Love anything. Can you still attack me? No. Uh oh. <laughs> Myself in a bad spot. <laughs> You're like, I better nuke it before before it's too late. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's a that was a spicy decision that we made there. Well, you can't do a lot. You still can't do a lot there. Uh -huh. Got a plan. Your Furbies are going down. Right, <clears throat> right they are. <laughs> Since your Furbies are not going down. <laughs> I don't even like Furbies. Trying to burn the earth, it's cool. <laughs> Let's see. ID there. So, this game's tagline is chess, but a lot. Chess, but a lot. Yeah, I'd, I'd kind of agree with that assessment there. And it, it certainly lives up to the... Uh, it's a name, to say the least. Especially like you try to learn any specific character and you're like, wait a minute, this is complicated. I can't hit that at all. Oh, poor little flame. Why does that turn into a candle? Oh. It's just a weird upgrade path for it. Well. Well, I guess because it can't move anywhere in the corner. <laughs> no. That's fair. Honestly, with the piece you destroyed, it might be a worthy trade. Pretty confident you're going to win this, but we'll see. Uh, I might. Yeah, we'll see. I, I, I have faith. I 
<laughs> I'll just run Mazarin through the whole thing. She'll take care of problems. Probably. So any any of the armies reaching out to you, Corndan, sound like a I thing that you might want to play? I'm trying to figure that out. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That that gave me a good laugh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hello and welcome to the fire. I like the fire. The fire's cool. Well, like Gentle. the opposite of that. Gentle and here for the help. It's here to help. Hmm. You want to see the Furby episode of Milk Chan? Uh oh. I don't know what that is, but I don't think I want to see that. Okay, let's see. Eh, all good. Yeah, your flyer is scary. I don't quite know what to deal with it. It's not that scary. Come on. So Look at him, he's got a big eye. There's a big eye. It does have a big eye. Yeah. It's very terrifying, honestly. <clears throat> so if you're out there and you're like, I don't want to deal with any but chess pieces, there is a character that plays with just a chess board. Uh, there is, well, a character that plays with just a shogi board. So I think that's... that's those, are, those are options if you don't want to branch out. Do with my life. I have an idea. Oh yeah? I think. Oh good. I don't think Corndan can kill me. Hell Inferno? Well That cool. turns all my candles into demon fire. Convenient. Very convenient, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, Demon Fire can move in cardinal directions as well as fire a shot in eight different directions. It is your turn. I know. I'm working on okay. it. Okay, I get the way that she works now. <laughs> now, I, I, I was trying to figure out like exactly how this character worked, you know? Oh, yeah. Yeah, now I sort of understand. Okay. Essentially a rook, but it can shoot as if capturing like a knight. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Oh, wow, that's really cool. I, 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 I never put that together. That, that It's really just that simple. I'm sorry, it's Heck Inferno Bellowing. My apologies. Okay, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? Uh... Ooh. Ooh. Don't love it. I was going to corner myself. Seems safe. Sort of. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. And every character has some, like, it's, it's like challenges per character that end up being a neat little, like, this is how to learn the character kind of deals. Yeah. Yeah. And there is a single player campaign where you are forced to play as a, a specific character that I don't really mesh with, but I beat it anyway, and it felt like complete luck. <laughs> I love it. Okay, don't worry. I'm I'm deciding. I'm deciding what I want I to do. I believe in you. Hmm. Do I want to do anything about? It? No. No, I do not. <clears throat> 
So now my leader's on the centerpiece, so now I'm capturing at a, a high rate. Yeah, a decent rate. Yeah. Oh, I can't hit that. Oh, I thought I could hit that. No. <laughs> Can't believe I put Fire Girl in a spot that you can just hit her. How rude. Not yeah, that, this time. Dude, that was great. I mean, not for you, but it was great for me. <laughs> well, not, not my top 10 times ever. You're safe. Can't really do anything. I'm just going to move you around. Oh, yeah, I should have. Yeah, should have done a thing. Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> well, OK, there's there's that. Yeah. Especially with a character that's got a ranged attack, it's always jarring for it to happen. Let's see. Okay. Uh, okay. Hmm. Oh. You know what? I'll take that. <laughs> That's mine now. Oh, shoot. Can't believe you've done this. Am I just gonna chase you around the board while you eat my pieces now? Yep, that's that's what's gonna happen. Ah, uh, yeah, I got lucky that you missed a way to kill my flying dude. <laughs> oh, dang! Dang! <laughs> Ouch! I wonder if that cost me the world. I like the uh, the the soldier evolves. If you keep upgrading them, they get really nasty. If you keep going down the uh, the kill upgrade path with those, they start getting some really neat powers. Oh yeah, I uh, <laughs> I can imagine. It's your turn, by the way. Wait, no, it's not. I mean, it was your turn. Oh, whoops, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I saw the upgrade, I'm like, huh, okay, I see what's going on. Let's see what he does with this. And just sat there, my bad. So if you ever pass a turn, it gives the opponent, uh, it gives the opponent some domination points. So you gotcha, can't just gotcha. <laughs> Ah, there. Also, your flying dude has two hit points. So. Oh, really? Yep. Okay. There's a little heart on it. So I could have hit it. I should have gone for it. Well, that makes life easy. Oh, right. Doesn't it? Thanks for thanks for that reminder there. Hey, okay. we're, we're we're this is not a hyper competitive game. Oh, it is so competitive. It should you know? be. Yeah. Oh, never mind then. Apparently it's hyper competitive now. I wonder if I can win just by running away and letting victory points come in. What am I doing? Apparently I'm dying. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the moment when Zest became esports. 
<laughs> when Zest became esports. Yeah, good title there. Okay. Well, that's not a spot I want to be in. I feel like things are going to get scary for you before they get scary for me. But I'm not quite sure. Hit you, but it won't do anything. <laughs> I just need to keep you. Oh, okay, that's how those work. That's fine. I have so much mana and nothing to do with it. There's another character in the game that has like a 50 mana just win the game button. It is extremely good. <laughs> That's pretty great. It's rare that it happens, but you know. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Enough pieces get blown up. Things start to happen. This is not the piece I want on the home goal. <laughs> it's, it's the piece I'll take. Uh, the fly cannot be cloned. It's got to be from a drone, I believe. Yeah, so you need right. the baseline unit. Well, that's okay. We'll get there. We're working on it. It's going to give you the space you need to thrive over there. Aw, thank you. So you just get victory points if I take too long on my turn, right? Uh, I'm not sure. I think maybe, but I think I mostly... once you go past the red bar on the timer, that's sort oh, of interesting. how it works there. Yeah, I like it. So as long as I can go relatively quick, I should be fine. Mm -hmm. yeah. a pass. You can just pass. Bottom right. Nerd. Passing. Can't believe you do that. What are you attacking? There we go. Like a thousand smiling suns. Okay. Well, that was fun. Victory by conquest. Okay. I didn't like that character as much. All right. Do uh, you want to play against Corn Dan to get him on the action? Corn Dan, you want to play? Sure. Well, I'm stopped. Will, I'm not going to fight I you. Anymore. I will observe this round if that's all right. I know you invited sure. me to be on Don't Make Us Board, but really, I just wanted a, an excuse to be like, hey, let's play Zest for a while. I am really enjoying this. Let me go ahead and host, and I'm going to pull up some music as well so that we can have yes. been in the background. Yeah. Been I'm, ex I'm excited to see what Corn Dan's username is. Rain Desk. Oh, I, I like it. this. Rain desk with an exclamation point. Very nice. Oh, that's a hell of a dragon. Look at this dragon. Yeah, he's got fish too. You know what? I gotta go with with that guy. <laughs> and it says in the like the corner, like what kind of character? Like it's a simple character. It's not a simple character. Yeah, Apparently, just choose I your. I accidentally hit back. Whoops. I'll hit back then. Okay, hosting. And the the character in the far bottom right is Metonym. That's the that's the final boss of the Princess Remedy, uh, Princess Remedy Two that you can play as. Yeah. I don't understand her characters. They are completely ridiculous. I'm still and they being just a... have... still being a dragon. 
Oh yeah, no, this is uh, this is a Reagan Reagan Slova game. But yeah, made by the same person. Yeah, I think that's awesome. Yeah, he he tends to the the dev themselves tends to put a lot of uh, a lot of similar characters in the game. Yeah. Uh, in most of them. Oh, you're a potato. Oh, the what is that guy? Good what? Luck. That guy. A potato. That guy. That, that guy. guy is the, the secret final boss of Princess Remedy. Okay, let's see what I can do here. Uh, move my fish. It's a fish. I actually don't know your character at all. Well, it's the same. <laughs> oh, I love it. This is going to be an exciting and beautiful match here. Okay, I sort of understand what this guy is all about. Okay. Uh... You can shimmy. Why is there a planet in the middle? What does oh, that's the... the capture point. That's for uh, when you want to get a, a conquer victory is you sit on the planet in the middle. Oh, so that's oh, how so you got victory? Yeah, I'm sorry. I thought that was clear. My apologies. I thought I explained it. My bad. I had no idea. <laughs> yeah, the capture thing is uh, like your your Cosmo Dragon has a capture rate of 30. OK, so okay. sitting that on the main planet will get you 30 victory points. But usually sitting in the middle uh, is a terrifying aspect. I can imagine <laughs> that, yeah. Wait, chess upgrade, double fish. That's right, double fish. Oh, you've got the... Cordan's got the stones. I do. I love the stones, because you just make walls with them sometimes. Some of these things move weird. I mean, it's cool. <laughs> it's cool and all, but let's see. Uh... I see it's like, are you playing as just a large dragon that's split up into several pieces to make I up one giant dragon? I think I am very much, uh, very much a fractured dragon of sorts. <laughs> <laughs> like, I see the wings and the claws and stuff, and that's pretty cool. Yeah, I like it. Uh, by the way, the, the claw thing, uh, the left-handed claw can only go up, right, or down, left, and then the other one goes the other directions. So it's really a fascinating idea. I like it. Oh, that's clever. Uh, and let's see. The, uh, the dev has said, like, these are not exactly balanced, but he will exact, uh, they will accept feedback. And when, if you point out like, hey, this is really weak in this spot, or like, this is really strange in this way. Gotcha. Uh, oh, you've got a horn. It goes forward. <laughs> Both of you playing characters that only have one hit point. Oh no. Wait, I only have one hit point? Is that my... Yeah, is that this guy? No, yep. Oh. Yeah, there's no heart on your character. And it looks like a lot of Korndan stuff deals two hit points. Along with your claws. Oh yeah, the, the swords. Those could be a little bit rough. Korndan's got that race car in there. Yeah. Yeah. Good, good. Uh, oh my gosh. What does that... What does the puffy cloud thing mean? Puffy cloud thing. Like, the the wind... It looked like a wind puff, anyway. What just shot me? Oh my gosh, I do not <laughs> like your slimy tears. Okay, no slimy <laughs> tears for me. Does bro have any good spells? He might. I see Hype Snake on uh, on Corndan's side. I'm excited by that. And the zero mana, that guy thing. Which I forget what that does. I'm dying to know what the chess upgrade. Chess upgrade means you get it to the back, upgrade it like a chess piece. What uh, double fish means. Yeah, uh, how do you, what do you need to do in order to upgrade? So a chess upgrade means get it to the back row of the opponent's side. Like oh, you would okay. like a pawn. 
Gotcha. Uh, a shogi upgrade means get it on the opponent's half of the side. They're like the back three. I think it's like back three or back four rows. Ah. Uh, like you would upgrade a shogi piece. Okay. Other places upgrade through kill. Uh, other places upgrade when they hit the uh, hit the earth in the middle. Okay, gotcha. Uh, bam. Fish is doing work. Yeah. Uh oh, you so got close. chronic hype. Scary. <laughs> That's okay. Uh. And you can click on corn dance spells to see what they do. Oh, okay. We've got that chronic hype. Give opponent less time to take their turn for five turns. That's nice. Thank you, Corn Dead. <laughs> And not to advertise other people's games. This is just, I, I, this is my favorite developer and this game is free. Like it has online play, works out of the box and it's a free video game. Free is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It has a very ah, short single player. But, right you know, there. Grab a friend and force them to play Zest with you. Uh oh, warning. I don't know who the warning was for. Oh. Uh -oh. I don't know. It might be that guy is in attack range, maybe? Oh, yeah. I, I gotcha. I gotcha, oh, Corn Dan. The horn! The horn! Okay, uh, change character. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that was a quick one. Why don't you two get that again? That I, I don't mind just fun. watching and shouting. What is this thing? Oh, I guess you are selecting character first. Okay. Now, the, the chess character is the skeleton-looking thing at the top. And uh, the straight-up shogi character is Tokinoko, which I swear just looks like my wife. I am doing United Earth! And we are going to use bats. That's what Earth bats. is all about. I like bats a lot. I don't know. That juice defeats that guy. <laughs> Okay, so this is my command base. Uh, it only has one HP, huh? Okay, let's go. Yeah. The uh, United Earth is a lot of pieces that don't have direct attacks and mostly just shoot bullets at things. Yeah, that's what it looks like. <laughs> Uh, Korndan's side is a pretty much a straight up a shogi board. So you'll have like gold general, silver generals, that kind of stuff. Okay. Gotcha. Which uh, I think shogi is a really cool game, but I don't understand shogi very well. Like I get I get the core concepts, but I'll never be good at it in the slightest. And like all of all of her pieces upgrade like shogi pieces would. I'm gonna grab myself a drink while this exciting showdown is going on. Okay, let's go ahead and get that moving up there. Uh-oh! Well, that's okay. Yeah, so the in the single player story, one of the missions is against the United Earth character. And uh, it, it's built in such of just, there's no guarantee that you win that fight if the opponent does a certain thing at the start. But you know, RNG. Sometimes it just doesn't do it and you're fine. Uh... Is it my turn? I'm watching on a delay, but it looks like. Uh, yeah. Okay. I guess it was. There's, a, there's an arrow on your I side of the screen. I very confused. <laughs> okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, I am.
Ooh. Yeah, the, that artillery is nasty. But Earth is not super mobile, and they don't have a lot of options. But you can, uh, like when an assault ship hits the back wall, it'll teleport back to the bottom row again. Mm hmm. I have no idea what United Earth spells do. Uh, well, I don't like that. <laughs> just a, a piece just breaks in through the front and threatens the uh, central command. Yeah, that. That central command for you, you know, always, always in trouble. So, Corndan, do you do you know how to play Shogi? Do you play Shogi? I mean, I've played Shogi before, but Ooh. no, not really. All right. So you're, you're like in my boat of like, I generally know how the Silver General moves, but how do I make this good? I don't know. So when a bat kills something, it turns into an evil moon, which is basically a Death Star. Yeah, uh, that's what I'm seeing here. Okay. And you can spend a mana point to turn it back into a bat if you want. And now Cordan has a dragon. I'm terrified of this dragon. I'm not too terrified. Ooh. So also, Solmir. I believe revives a piece you've defeated on the opponent from the opponent. Sure it is. <clears throat> well, there we go. Got another one. All right. Oh, let I me, forgot. Me... I need. I need to share. Why am I not sharing my stream on in the blue room? Oh, I mean, I'm watching on there. I saw it happen. You're a jerk. Uh, let me. Let me. Sorry. Let me play against Bro, and that's probably gonna be. That's probably going to be the hour at that point. Okay, yeah, if you would be, if you would like to, that I would, would love to. Okay, I liked Earth. This was cool. Okay, stop fighting. I'm done fighting. <laughs> Corn Dan, let's stop fighting, okay? Corn Dan will never be done fighting. That's true. All right, I'm going to get weird. Well, I might get weird as well. I don't know who this is or what they do. But that's kind oh, of wow. the excitement yeah. here. I... I really enjoy chess, though. You're gonna be purple... purple melty girl, huh? That's meta him. Okay. The uh, final boss of, uh... I'll have night hands. Okay, I recognize some of these. Here's the thing with meta him. I don't understand. You what? I don't understand Metonym at all. All of her pieces go everywhere. Oh, these are terrifying. bizarre. <laughs> I don't yeah. like these. Yeah, you're clicking through a little bit and be like, what is this? Uh, it's called Your <clears throat> Pieces Are Messed Up and uh, I'm gonna die probably. That's, that's what I'm seeing. So, Metonym has, like, almost no ways to move her pieces backwards on their own. She has to spend mana to bring them back. Oh, oh okay, good luck then. Is that the 50 mana win button? Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's the 50 mana win button. <laughs> but there's also, if you put Metonym on Earth, you upgrade to true Metonym and she becomes completely useless. Uh oh, that's not good. What is this arrow thing? It's terrifying. Which arrow thing? The, the slash you have here. Is that like a... S oh, I get it. You're like a... Hmm, okay, I got it a little bit. No, which arrow thing are you talking about? Your slash thing you moved up forward that's sitting next to Earth. Oh, yeah, I guess that is mine. Awesome. Cool. Oh, it keeps changing. Oh, God. Can I? Did you just win? No, you did not just win. You did threaten me, though. Uh -huh. It changes direction every time you move it. 
So there's this, uh, in this game it has vague lore about like the celestial race. And I believe there's like three characters of the celestial race in this game. Okay. Why is it gonna murder me if I touch it? What can, oh. And uh, that is one of them. They're like the presumably like weirdly corrupted one or something. Okay, I need to do something with my life. There we go. You uh -huh. need to do something with your life? Yep. Good job. I'm proud of you. Okay. Uh, in that case, let's go ahead and... Oh. You have terrifying pieces. I, hope I you like... Know this. I'm starting to enjoy my pieces, okay? Oh, whatever. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't seem like that bad. Actually, that's a pretty good trade, honestly. Um, how can I make you not? That seems fine. Okay. And your little, these things are like, sir. Yeah, they go one space and end. <laughs> I have a terrible plan. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. That's, that's a fine plan. Seems like a good plan, right? Uh-oh. Uh, okay, I'm fine. Well, you can do nothing with that now. Just leave it there as a credit to everything that happened. <laughs> yeah, it just yeah. sends a message, right? Yeah, yeah, you see, uh, you see what happens when, I don't know, stuff like this happens? You see what happens? Huh? See what happens, Larry? You know what happens? See. Meadow is all about weird, I think. Confuse your opponents into the back. Send it all the way to the back. Oh dear. That threatens none of my pieces. <laughs> eh. That threatens none of your pieces. I didn't know yeah. what it would do, but hey, there we go. No, we're we're good. It's worth finding out. I'm gonna do Oh, that deals two damage too. Not like I have any. Well, my my one weird-looking king face has two hit points. Now it's a CD. No, it's not. That was a better plan in my head. <laughs> like straight up that was a great plan in my head yeah really chat is very confused about these pieces like just know like all my pieces move really strangely and all of bros kind of have a semblance and order to them yeah, basically, out of all the pieces here, yours are the dumbest. Oh, really? <laughs> God. Well, look! Look at the, the King Jelly here. He's just... They're doing their best. I suppose. 
I want to do cool if things. If his best but... is being a freaking nerd, then yeah. Oh, I forgot to move. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's too bad. <laughs> yeah, that was too bad. <laughs> I don't know what threatens that, but I'm in. Oh, that. Okay. Eh. Why are you a CD? CDs. Uh. <laughs> skills? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I don't have any mana at all. <laughs> well, okay. Everything is weird. <laughs> yeah, that's what it seems like. <laughs> Why can't my fish hurt you? Because you're fish. Just dumb fish. Whoop! Uh, Arcade Park, this game has online multiplayer. You can't pick your own username, but... That's yeah. fine. Yeah, that's completely radical <laughs> and fine and you know what? What? I don't know where I'm going. Here, that's a good place. You know, it's better because I was just going to take it with the fish. Meet mana. Any sort. All of your pieces just sail forward like an arrow and they're terrifying. Yeah, that's what yeah, they're but then about. They don't do anything. Well, that's not where I wanted that. <laughs> I didn't realize it was a piece behind it. <laughs> <laughs> the worst possible outcome there. Anyway, the bat is moving into action. Here we go. figured out my idea. No, my bat! Oh no, my sword! Not my sword! Into a divisive match. Huh. Oh. Well. I guess that makes sense. Bro, what magic do you have? Summon anything? Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, I don't know what this does. Let's. Dark Star, huh? Oh god, what does that do? Uh... Well, it's pretty good now. More move. Yeah, that is pretty good. I have a unicorn horn now. 
Well, good for you. And oh, and you've very... got two hit points. Yeah. That was pretty cool. Oh. I just had the kitten come yell at me so that when I would turn and look at him, he'd run off. Aw. It's adorable. Yeah, no, your character is just... hits, like, everything in the universe around it right now. <laughs> oh, yeah! Okay, uh... What's your other ability there? Ah. Oh. Hmm. Oh, that could be fun. Whoa! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> <laughs> I can do literally nothing about this. You are so dead. <laughs> I can't even like reel away. I'm gonna do it anyway. Huzzah! Bam! Yeah, that juice. <laughs> GG, Jesus. Yeah, that, that was awesome. That was a good round. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that was really, oh my gosh, this has a lot of interesting mechanics in it. Yeah, I like that juice. It's a good name. <laughs> that equals juice wins. I would love to, at some point in my life, host a ZZS tournament of some sort, but we'll see if we can make that happen one day. If there's, if there's interest. Definitely should sometime. Absolutely. Well... That's the hour. Thank you so much for letting me show you this video game for an entire hour. Oh my gosh, that is Xess, Chess, whatever you want to call it. It, it is on itch.io and it was free. It is free. Yeah. And it is very good. A lot of the characters there may not be balanced, but they are certainly fun. Thank you for having me for this hour. I hope you enjoyed Zess. I uh, certainly did. If y'all out there in chat want to maybe like maybe talk about a Zest tournament, well, we'll see what we got. What what? I, I do, that wasn't my motive today, but I'll if you put one on, I will join. I'll probably forget my promise, uh, so you have to remind me. But I will join. Oh no, don't worry. I'll, I'll harass people until they get going. But um, yeah. thank you so much. You all enjoy Sharif and uh, NPC and Time Stalker today. So y'all, you have a good one, and I'll see you soon. Thanks for having me. Heck yeah! Bye. Yeah. Bye. Ah, uh, Corn Dan. I finally feel like I am the Xess Master. A winner is you. It's a winner is something, yeah. Well, Not me. it looks like Sharfers is getting ready. Uh, oh my gosh, sorry. I'm, I'm going to be sitting here thinking about that game for a while because this is what well, happens to my brain. I get obsessed. Now it's, it's time to try to find out who shot Johnny Rock. Maybe it was me. Maybe it was. Let's go talk Maybe. to Sharif. Let's go find out. Hello there, Sharif. Hi. Hey, who shot Johnny Rock? Did you shoot? Did you do it? No, he's already dead. I, 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 I cannot. I, I would shoot him if I could. Because that would, it wouldn't exist. But he's a nerd. Fortunately. Giant Rock's supposed to be a cool cat. Meow. Well, uh, yeah, go ahead and get your game up and let... Yeah, and go ahead and tell us. What have you been up to? What's going on in the Sharfer's life? In the, the Peach go-kart life, I guess. I'm just spinning out in the go-kart, mostly. 
probably oh. more Barbie. That's all she does. She just spins I out. I haven't been playing that much Barbie recently, if I'm being really? honest. Really? Well, same. Uh, yeah, we're on the same page there. Uh, <laughs> I've been playing... Um, I've been just going through this like long backlog of games I've been wanting to play. Um, and I'm always on the hunt for FMV games, and I and I, I was looking at my Sega CD collection, and I found this. So that's like all through. the Sega CD collection. Basically, the entire thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's like uh, I'm, I'm looking for one that's not it. Mm. Oh, don't it's spin the lunar out. Games. But okay. even the lunar games are like half FMV. They do have a lot of FMV cutscenes. You're right. I'm, I'm gonna think of I'm gonna think of one that's not FMV at some point. I promise. Eh, you don't need to. I like FMVs, you know, I, I watch them, I'm like, that is certainly an F. M... B... Yep. This what is does... an F for sure. This game is horrendous. Oh, no. Oh, well, yeah, I'll, I'm just waiting for you to get the game up so I can capture it. Oh my god, Otherwise... I forgot to hit start... Um, I forgot to start streaming to... I'm, I'm having a day, don't worry about See, it. See, I just, I just gotta I'm do so the sorry. gentle nudging. The gentle nudging. Mm. Next time to say hey. This... You hey, dig. hey, shoppers, we, we want to stream live. So we might not know who shot Johnny Rock, but after watching this, you after watching what? There. We won't care who killed him either? You won't care, certainly. Um, <laughs> I will certainly we be don't happy care. that he died? Uh, I'm not upset about it, I will say that. Nothing, okay, not, that's nothing of value is lost, I will say that much. It only... It's only important as much as I have to investigate it, which is a huge pain. But other oh my than that, gosh. I know, right? Gotta do your day job. Day job going out on the street. Go and find the... the bad guys. Okay, we gotta take down the bad guys and... pull that's them in the of, slammer. That's, that's kind of the vibe we were going for in this game. Yeah. Yeah, they don't stand a chance. You know? Hey, wise guy, eh? Johnny had something in common. Dynamite. Dynamite! Yeah, so the good news is that all of the cutscenes, cut well, most of the cutscenes in this game are skippable. Uh, I'm gonna choose to not skip any of them. Got a pad for content. Johnny Rock was good. There will you got be a many... pad for content? There, I'm gonna die so many times. This is not a game, um, this is not a game where you can be rusty. Like, I haven't played this in a couple of weeks, so I am rusty. Okay. It'll be worth your time. Oh, they can see? Is, is it, they can see now? Looks like Yeah, they you. can see the game. Yeah, I've got it up. All right, so the object like of the, the game green. is to, so yeah. So this is a game that, uh, that, um, that uh, supports the Justifier light gun on Sega CD. I am not using it because I, I don't know where mine is and I don't want to set it up. So I'm going to use the control pad, which makes it so much worse. Um, oh, this whole game yeah. is a it's it's one of those like shoot shooting games, like a shooter game. But it's also FMV. It's it's truly a mess. Uh, we're going to go into options because I'll show you that I'm, I'm playing on the easiest possible uh, okay. setting here. So I'm going to we're, we're playing on wimp here. Easy is oh, too no. hard. OK, um, uh, flash the flash color. color being blue is good because the white flashing color is, as you might guess, hurts, hurts the eyes a bit. OK, um, the Sega CD also had a mouse peripheral. Yes, it did. Did anybody own one? Not to my knowledge. I did not. I certainly did not either. I didn't have a Sega anything. <laughs> No, 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 I had the Game Gear. Yeah, but that's it. No, didn't have Long a mouse for that. Ga Long live the Game Gear. Long die the Game Gear. Mine doesn't most work anymore. Here doesn't, no, oh. most of them don't. You have to get them, you have to get the caps replaced. They're just they're not, the screen is just really poor quality, honestly. All right, we're just going to start here. Uh, there's some, there's going to be a, a tiny bit of a lore dump, and I'll kind of explain how the game works. It's control pad here. So Sounds we'll just start good. like now. There, done. Oh. There's uh, someone to see you, boss. As soon as I saw her, I knew she was trouble. Oh no, trouble. I need your help. Then I made my first mistake. I said I'd listen. Telegram for you, boss. Green, green. All right, so I got killed us because I, I was like a, a, a pixel time. late. Duh. So we can, we can talk about how, uh, we can talk about oh, how no. death works in this game. Uh, you have money in the top corner, uh, and every time you die, you, you pay $200 to the doctor. 
Okay. And um, so you get five logs per continue. There you go. I shot him this time. She doesn't care. It's fine. I shot him. So the whole game is this. There are basically these scenes and you shoot people. And that's it. That's all of the, that's most of the video, the, the actual gameplay. This is another cutscene. And that okay. Night, somebody made his wish come true. Healthcare is cheap because it's like the fifties. Jeez, man, oh, I want to go. Back you have to a finite fifties. When I got to Johnny, Rock, you have a finite number of uh, of hand. bullets here. So if I if I shoot the bullets here, that number tells us oh, what RNG no. seed we're on. I have no idea how to interpret it though. Oh, uh, there's a ton of RNG in this game. Johnny and I. You can go um, ahead. there's a ton of RNG in this game. Uh, you'll see it. Um. Here's the first bit of RNG, so there's two people who are going to come in here. One of them shoots you, and one of them gives you flowers. I always choose this guy. I asked. I shot him too early. Uh, there, there, there are cont infinite continues in this game, so there's nothing, nothing happens. So there's a bunch of these little... Wait, so you shot the wrong guy? I just shot too early. Oh. I want you to find them. I asked... Did it again. <laughs> Shut up. Mm -hmm. I you 400 he deserves it. All right, so this is my last. This is my last life on this continue. But again, it doesn't really it doesn't truly matter. Oh yeah, see, so I need to shoot the guy on the on the left on the left side. So this is a game over. Fine. There's infinite continues. This reminds me a lot of Mad Dog. Yeah, it's 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 it's, it's more unfair than Mad Dog McCree. Oh yeah, this... she was following. She said she didn't think so. Besides, how do you turn down a dame that gives you roses? Yeah, it's definitely more unfair than Mad Dog. This this game is very unfair. The key to the in my oh, opinion. absolutely. So what's the point of money? Uh, just lives. You can also buy bullets because there are a finite number of bullets, and if I shoot like during a cutscene or whatever, um, it actually uses up your bullets. Let's give that how did you not um, get him? Oh yeah, you have to you have to you have to go very early. If he starts shooting before you start shooting, you die no matter what. This, this is making me angry. This game, it gets worse. Much worse. Also, I love that she doesn't even care about anything that's going on. She's not even reacting. That's the best part. Open the telegram. All right, so this is this is the, the, the bulk of the gameplay. So there's four areas where we got to go. One, uh, The killer's in one of those four areas. It's random which one it is. Um, so we have to go to all four areas, then go to Johnny's house, then go to his safe, figure out which four, and then arrest him. That's the whole gameplay. Oh. I always start with the casino, because the this... casino has a... So, yeah, so go, we have to go, go to the go, casino, go. the warehouse, the pool hall, and the garage. And we just came from our office, and then this is how you buy ammo. It's 50 bucks for a refill. Um, so we're going to go to the casino. Oh, I took too long. Who cares? Um, so we're gonna go to the casino first because the casino has a soft lock. So if I soft lock, I can just restart the game and not lose too much time. Hey Sharif, did yeah. you know that there's a version of this game for the um, CDI? No way, really? Nurse? Yeah. I did not know that. Th does not surprise me certainly, but because this game is of that quality. So okay, so this is how this game works. Um, so there are every level has like two uh, parts. Um, every level has two parts. There's like the entrance to the level, and then there's like the the actual level itself. There are always um, in these in these levels there are bad guys who jump out and shoot at you. Um, this is the one I can't tell what, what's happening at all, and it, it's like a stairwell or something. And there yeah. are always good guys that you can't shoot. Also, if you shoot, you die. If you shoot them, you die. If the bad guy shoot you, you die. So that guy just shot me again. No so you have to. So I just game over it again, but it doesn't matter. You make the camera yeah, angle is very weird. Yeah, shoot the Grim Reaper, or not? I guess <laughs> the Mortician, whatever. And Oops. now we have twelve hundred dollars again. So yeah, there's a score down here as well. I don't by know. By the way, it, this but... is by the makers of Mad Dog McCree, so that's why I was getting the same vibes with the yeah. with the Mortician. However, this is definitely worse. Like this is the easiest oh, difficulty. Gosh. How? This is this is the wimp. They're actively insulting me, and I still I've beaten this game I think like twice or something. We're not even in the casino yet. Oh, he killed me again. You have to be ready. I can't be distracted. I've I've got to be laser focused here. So of course we're gonna talk to you while while you're doing it. Oh, that's the whole point. This game is incredibly boring if you don't talk about it. So don't shoot that lady because she's she's actually a good she's a good guy here. She's like a hostage situation. 
Got him. Got him. Whoa. No. Don't. No. Oh yeah, people talk about this several times. I just shot him directly in the face twice. All right, so we're in the casino. Fun. That yes. took way too long. Oh yes, Mad Dog McQueen sucks actually uh, already. This game sucks worse. I've played both. No, I love Mad Dog McCree. But I also played it on PC with a mouse. There she was in the I, yeah, so I assume this, with the CDI, I might set up the, the light gun and actually play with a light gun. Uh, that might be fun. No, it won't be, but I mean, it'll be less unfun. So here we are. Yeah. Got her. So this yeah. guy up here, if he shoots me, the whole game soft locks. No, I can't shoot her. She's dead. So why would you pop out and go, oh no, don't shoot me. I do that do all the that? time, you know. <laughs> they shoot the the doctor, poor doctor. Oh man. He, casino, oh, okay, thank goodness you don't have to do the plate. stairwell again. No, no. Once you're in, you're in. Got him. Why does it soft lock? So it, I don't know. I haven't figured out why. But there's a character that pops out right here. And if that person shoots you, or you don't shoot it, it, the whole game just absolutely freezes. <laughs> it's that one. It's this one. That's why I have my thing up here. So now, see, now the whole game's soft locked. Uh, <laughs> oh so my yeah. gosh. And that's the why I have my cursor up here and why I do this first, because if this guy shoots you, the whole game uh, lo uh, soft locks. Um, <laughs> this I'm, I, have is so I have to reset. I actually have to reset. Um, so. Um, I act so I originally because I'm playing this on my Mega S my my analog Mega SG Mega SD that whole situation because my my Sega CD the, my Sega CD situation is somewhat pre precarious in the sense that um is somewhat precarious in the sense yeah. that um uh you know that the, the optical disc is slowly dying so if I can not use it I won't um so but when I when I had that boy, when I had that soft lock happen I swapped to I the I have a physical disc of the game well. and so I swapped to the Sega CD John and then Rock. the same soft lock happened anyway it's part he of the game wanted to be on the hit had nothing to do with the rom at all and that night somebody made his that's kind of ridiculous but amazing at the same time i like it is it. quite amazing when i when i found out that that was actually a bug in the game Johnny, are you there? Johnny, what's the lucky number? Johnny, uh, what's apparently the... electronic gaming Johnny monthly I... gave the 3do version of this a 4.8 out of 10. We were going to be that's married. very generous there's a 3do version too the there's know. a dos version too and the dos version actually looks to good find... does it though i asked the I DOS mean, versions of these tend to be relatively good. I asked if she was followed. She said she didn't think so. So that, that's that's the speed strategy. You just shoot one of them randomly, and if you get it wrong, just shoot the other guy, and you lose like one second. The key to the like Shut VD up. VVD DV video, that one. Video quality tends to be a little bit better on PC, at then least in this, this era. Is? Yeah. I imagine the 3DO or the CDI version would be a little bit better just because they're more powerful machines than a Sega CD, but who knows? Let's no. find out. Then I open the telegram. The VDD. All right, back to the casino, but I have to get into the casino again. But it might be a different entrance because the, the entrances are also randomized. So they, they're the one we got. I don't want to go to the ammo shop. Get me out of here. Oh, I, I gave money for some ammo. Um, so they're, they, the one, the entrance we got is like a middling one in terms of difficulty. This is an easy one. Ooh, okay. Oh. So, some of them you have to kill one character like that. There's another one with a, a guy throwing a, a Molotov cocktail behind a car. You just blow the whole car up. And then there's one where you, you, you there's an, a window entrance that's genuinely impossible. Okay. Did I shoot that lady? No, I didn't. Don't shoot that lady either. No! I absolutely shot this guy. We're gonna reset. Um, so <laughs> this is who shot Johnny Rock for the Sega CD. Oh my um, gosh! Fine. This is I, I mean this was this was part of the not the plan, but this was definitely a known thing when I started. Um, we're just gonna. I, that's why I keep my 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 mouth. The, the problem is it's kind of hard to react to. Um, it's kind of hard to react to it, especially if I don't have the 
game audio up like super loud. Someone to see. Telegram for you, boss. All right, so I'm looking at videos here. The 3DO version is clearly the the most quality Someone one. Or not 3DO, oh. CDI. CDI? Okay, I'll, and I'll and look then, into getting a CDI. And then the 3DO and and the DOS version Johnny basically Rock look the same. And this okay. one looks like garbage. Damn. Oh, this looks bad. Johnny this is very oh, bad. This is worse than Wirehead somehow. I asked if she was being followed. All right, so she didn't think so. Yes. So you can, so you can, you can shoot that lady. It's totally fine. She doesn't care about getting shot. I'm glad. So this is you know. now you're looking at the speed run of the game here. So there you go. So you can get through this in about 20 seconds. Then I open the telegram. And we're back. Okay, that's good to know. And yeah, that's that why is going... a relatively fast way to get back in. Yeah. So that's why Casino First is not like a huge deal. Oh yeah, this is the other one I was talking about where you can just shoot the guy who's gonna Molotov cocktail you here. So we're back in the casino. Good effects. I like As it. As if nothing happened. And we'll soft lock, so nothing did happen. Casino. I knew Johnny Rock had played in this private club. Watch some fast. Shut up. I sh ah, he's going to shoot me. This is the one of the hard ones to get because I'm, I start my, my cursor all the way on the right side. The casino. The casino. <laughs> Little dramatic, dude. Oh, these are some of these are very, very good. Okay, I, I, I love how like <laughs> headshot. <laughs> oh, I shot the lady. Oh yeah, yeah. It's a good <laughs> shot. Some people, I, I did, I streamed this. Like, I, I, I started with like, I'm like, I have never beaten this game. I'm gonna beat this game tonight. And uh, it took me like four hours. But the run I ended up with was like. <laughs> that looked like Lucy. I shot, the lady. I I shot Lucy. Lucille Ball. Oh. Yeah, I shot Lucille Ball for sure there. Last life. So who shot Johnny Rock? It was definitely us. It was probably us. We shot everybody. <laughs> oh, in the pool hall, there's a guy who falls on top of a table. He has to jump up, and it's extremely funny. I hope we get there. We shot him. This is garbage, man. Oh, my god. Maybe you just don't want to play this game. This game. <laughs> I definitely shot him that time. I was ready. Oh. Uh, I'm liking this game enough that I'm gonna let that slide. I apologize. Liking, you want You guys want to see a different it. area? How about how about we go see the other areas and then come back to the, the yeah, casino? Yeah, yeah, I feel yeah, like yeah. that's reasonable. And if we'll go to the warehouse. Blocks, then we get, get a gong. Then we can gong. I think that's completely fair. Cool. Okay. I mean, I think it's worthwhile to gong who shot Johnny Rack anyway. Yeah. Actually, you know what? I don't feel bad about that. This is one of my least favorite games I've ever played in my whole life. And I've, 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 I've played my fair share of not very good when games. I got to Johnny Rock, How does it compare to Pears and Grey Witch? Oh, oh, no, no. Pears and Grey Witch is a masterpiece. You're kidding me. It's uh, it's a critique on uh, on public, on, on modern thinking. I'm pretty sure that has soft locks. I asked if she was following. Uh, yeah, it does, for sure. Besides, I'm also pretty sure. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it, it definitely rose. does. Okay. The film the quality. In the face. I don't know. I might invest in the CDI version of this. I'd say this might be a little bit more consistent than Paris and Grey Witch. <laughs> Nailed the rat. It's in, in, in that it doesn't. I mean, at least I can restart it without any problems. Isn't Paris, doesn't Paris and Grey Witch have a thing where if you die on a specific level, you have to like start everything over again and clear your save well, file you, or something? You have to uh, close the game and then come back. Yeah. All right. Uh, so here's the. This is the. Um, so this is the. This is the elevator entrance. We're going to the warehouse. Okay. No, we're going to the morgue. The warehouse. Oh, yes. The warehouse is actually a a um a what's Yay. the word a um a, a ah! dynamite factory. I have, to, I have to shoot this guy twice actually, and then this oh, guy. Okay. Why oh, that everybody. guy last? Because he's not hurting you otherwise. I mean, he eventually hurts you. Yeah, I know. You can't shoot him early, by the way. If you do, he die. He you get that. Well, you get yeah. the bad. 
All right, so we're in the warehouse now. I fought my way inside the high we'll, we'll, we'll listen to the. Uh, found the character it, it, it looks like we're um, we're gonna go make some dip. So they call me measles. We're this is the best acting in the whole game right here. Bones. They call me measles. Oh yeah, I. Uh... So this well. is actually a level with no RNG. The it's the same order every time. Do I remember that order? No. So. But it is the same order every time. How did how did you not hit him? He started shooting before I started shooting. No. I mean, I technically, that's him. how it works. You don't shoot fast enough when you're when you're shooting. Yeah. I think it's you now. So Wimp has these little those little flashing indicators. You see them? Yeah. Every so often, every so often it happens. Oh, good lord. But not always. Not always. If he's close enough to the screen, they don't give they don't give you the benefit of the anything. Yeah, but like when you're using a controller, I fought my way inside the high. Like they give you controller as an option. How are you even supposed to? How? I don't know. I don't know. This game isn't fair. Because it doesn't move very fast. I think it's you now. And you, and there's like one more up top, I think, up here. Yeah. I've used about 150 bullets or so. Ta, take that. Kaboot. I think there's oh. one more guy who you're supposed to shoot, like right here. Got him. All right. Yeah. That's, that's the warehouse done. Lots of explosions. I like it. Mouse will be 100% better, but I'm playing this for maximum hilarity. Copper, arrest me! I run a clean operation just to yeah, just shoot dynamite. him. I wasn't a cop any more than he ran Actually, one of my orders was not to shoot any of the of the of the big wings. Who's, who's going to be partners? Oh, really? I asked him for his clue to the safe. Yeah, it was part of like the telegram that you got. That's dumb. Which All right, so that's the plate. Remember plate, please. Somebody remember plate for me. Plate. All right. Uh, let's go to the pool hall. Ah, yes, the hallway. The old hallway. This one's oh. going to take a little bit. Mm -mm, good. <laughs> good in the neighborhood. Did I not shoot him that time? I thought I shot him that time. I'm pretty sure. Maybe it was just like you winged him. Pilates. You did Pilates? Okay. I think there's a guy here who brings a human shield. Don't shoot the human shield, but shoot the guy. So that's another one where you can't shoot too early because then you'll shoot the human shield. Let's give that but if he, but he shoots uh, a little late here. Now we're dead. <laughs> yeah, I. Uh, I would have loved there, playing think, this but... again with a mouse. I would have had. Yeah, a blast I might. With I might this. look into to playing with a mouse or playing with uh with a light gun. That might be more yeah. fun. Yeah, maybe play sell you on playing a better version. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can't believe I didn't shoot him that time. You, no, hey, not the casino, shot, please. You shot the mortician. Honestly, I had a... F no, I don't want to say he was a friend, an acquaintance. I guess a church acquaintance uh, who grew up and became a mortician. And he looked like a mortician before he became one. Like, seriously. Uh, he had scoliosis, so he had to have his spine fused. So literally, he always stands perfectly straight up. Uh, what are you doing? He's got black hair, pale skin. Like, I can't imagine any but any other job for him other than mortician. Oh, I shot one I frame too early there. Good, good. His job was morticia. <laughs> no. What? You know, like from the Adams family. I mean, I would, I would totally be down with having a friend become Morticia. So this guy just jumps on the pool table after you kill him, which is very good. Because that's how it works. This how it does. Out of money. Out of money. So you can see how many deaths doesn't actually lose all that much time; just loading times mostly. Then again, bullets don't really have knockback. And usually, like, at least at first, you're not you're not going to go flying anywhere. 
Like, you might not even realize you were shot for a little while. It's... Like a hot second? Yeah. This guy. Woo! Yeah. Did like a little stage dive there. So you would have time to dive onto the table. That'd be very. That feels. That feels dramatic, though, doesn't it? Well, to be fair, I don't know. If I got shot and I dying. knew that I was gonna die, I'd jump on the table. You don't know you're dying because of loading times, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's true. He was like, "Oh, my loading," or there we go. Jump. Uh -huh. Still very good. Then I think it's this guy right here. Oh no, it's the guy to his right, the, the little blur mm, of pixels there to the right. The guy that actually exists, uh, I couldn't tell, but yeah. The guy who's actually, yeah, exactly. This game, here's Fit taking offense to you playing. I love it's that true. he still shoots, but because he's dead, the bullet just doesn't work, you know? There we go. All right, all right. We're done. So we're done with the pool hall. What do you want? What do you want? Uh, yeah. Right, you know, it's like it's that it's that Michael Jordan meme. It's like I want to play I shot Johnny Rock, and then you 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 uh, cut to I shot Johnny Rock, and it's like, and I took that personally. Vase, vase. Everybody remember plate, plate vase. vase. Okay, plate ba plate vase right. is the we're order going important. to the gar the garage. Oh, it's this guy. This guy again. Uh -oh. The stroller. I like this guy. I went to the garage. This is maybe the easiest one because they gave you a lot of help here. It's a very big area. Pretty sure I have to shoot a guy twice in this one too. I think it's right now. Well. Or maybe like 20 times because he definitely didn't die. I went to the garage. I went to the garage. You can tell it was made in America because they say garage right. No money. Isaac, are you to... gonna take that <laughs> from him? Actually, wait, That's this could have been Canada. Canada. I don't think it's Canada. <laughs> I'll be real. I'll be real. The company was a name called American Laser Games. You tell Look, me. U.S. Gold. Where was U.S. Gold? To find a disease. I mean, Britain. Right. Oh, oh, you're the bright boy. Uh, beat it. We're busy. Hey. Okay, this was Albuquerque. Albuquerque. Albuquerque? Yeah. That was a good cutscene. It was a good cutscene. It was worth watching. And then here, I think. Like right here. Then maybe here someplace. No, here. They even told me, and I wasn't paying attention. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I've heard of New York fries. So, apparently, uh, the company Her Interactive I went bought to this company, American Laser Games, and then that was in 1999. A year later, uh, she was like, or Her Interactive was like, never mind, we're selling you to Digital Laser. I went to the garage. And so, so there's yeah, just one whole year it lasted? Yep, one whole year. Uh, the Nancy Drew, now now Pfizer's excited. But hey, Digital Leisure first acquired the rights to Dragon's Lair Space Agents and Dragon's Lair 2 Time Warp. Uh, did they another, actually another set make of games. I am. Dragon's Lair? I went to the garage. Which, which company is this? I need to know uh, now. Digital Leisure, or Leisure, whatever you digital call Digital Leisure. Uh, yeah, they did make some. They're not very good from my understanding, though. Okay, those versions aren't... <gasps> oh, wait. Let me take a look down here. Okay, so there's the box now, after that guy. No money? It's better so, this guy could save me, but I don't have any money, so he lets me die. So, yeah, that feels yeah. I, went to the garage. I actually don't know what the company worked on specifically, but uh, yeah, they bought this company. I'm pretty and sure I, I'm pretty they also sure made hologram hologram time traveler. That's a good I name, like, at least for a game. I like that game. It was a. It was apparently a coin-operated arcade game that delivered a real 3D hologram experience. Interesting. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Uh, may I ask what I did wrong there? Hey, game, what did I do wrong there? We're gonna have to you died.
No, but that's, yeah. that's really <laughs> that's as far as the group like that well. Right here. There's you. And then you. Shoot you. Alright, there we go. We did it. Huzzah. And there's this guy. Huzzah. And this Huzzah, guy in the box. Indeed. Are we done here? I told him. No more monkey business. No more monkey business. Johnny owed me a little money. So what? Everybody does. I got nothing to hide. Yeah, I so why? The the safe. All right, third, third. All right, all right. I don't even have to reach my. Here's the third. There. Here's the third clue. Okay. I don't know. Women. Head. Women. Statue. Sta head. Oh. Head. Statue. Dark head. Souls boss. Dark Souls boss. Easy. <laughs> Plate vase. Dark Souls boss. Casino. Oh God. <laughs> If we okay. if we soft lock here, it's absolutely over. Um. So yeah. So if that Bust. happens, I'll explain how you're supposed to beat the game. Um, okay. Don't soft lock. Come on, Johnny. Did I shoot her? Did I shoot oh, no. Lucille Ball? She lived. Did I shoot her? She lived. I did. Oh. I absolutely shot her. I shot that lady. I shot her dead. Well, she had it coming. The casino. She certainly did Johnny by jumping up in the middle of a fight. Oh my god, people, stop popping up in the middle of a fight. I think she Why lived. would you do that? Just stay. Okay. If you're... You can survive no one money. bullet. Sometimes. Sometimes, like if you get winged or something, sure. Yeah. It's just a, it's just a graze wound. The casino. Or if they shoot you in the foot, that like... That's not super deadly. Like, you could die from that, but... Yeah! I'm actively shooting... I'm, like, actively shooting Ooh. between the cutscenes now. I appreciate Don't it. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Alright, I won't shoot Why then. would you even jump out, then? That's, that's, that's what I'm asking. You achieved nothing doing that, and you're still... Yeah, patching you up. <laughs> you shot the nurse. Poor nurse. Oh, uh, she's the one who's not, like, helping me. The casino. It's true. I knew Johnny Rock casino. This private. Uh, you, you get a little leniency on this level for some reason. Well, do you see how far away that shot was? Just... Oh, Why did this happen to me? Sharif! You were I there! I was actively shooting. I don't know what happened. <laughs> well, so here's how the game works. Chat oh, heard once... the gong. <laughs> I did not hear the gong, but I assume it, it, it went on. It's so, there. Here's how the game here's how the game ends. We have a little bit of time. So after you kill uh, after you finish the, the fourth level, which in this case would have been the casino, we would have gotten a fourth clue. We would have got a Johnny Rock's house. And then you fight your way into his house as a bunch of people to kill and blah, 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 all that stuff. And then um, you uh, you get to uh, a room in his house, which has all of has every possible collectible thing that you can get. And so they've given you four random ones. You have to find them in order that you got them. That gives you the combination to his safe. Inside of the safe, once you get into the safe, which first of all is, is one through, it's... It's four digits, one through six, and you have to shoot the correct number, and they so they basically uh, they cycle through only once. And then once you get into the safe, then uh, it gives you a clue as to which of the four areas is actually the killer. Then you go back, and then you shoot the bad guy, and that's how you do it. You also have to, uh. you, have to you have to shoot a person in a in a casket in a funeral at some point. Um, it's yes. So this game is not very good. Me. Yeah, it's a great uh. game. I might try playing this on the Sega CD again, or on a different console, so maybe this soft log doesn't exist, but that's, uh... That's, uh... Faizu shot Johnny Rock. Oh, why didn't Faizu, you tell me? I to go through all this. we know now! Oh my gosh, okay, Faizu, that's good thank know. you so... Well, he deserved it. And just for... Just to make it a little bit better, they did hear it very faintly. It was like a very distant gong. I'll try to make it louder this time. Here we go. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that was kind of louder, like a little bit. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, seriously, uh, this Sharif, he just had bad luck. Bad luck.
It's all right. Bad spawns. I, I, I knew I knew what I was getting into when I tried to uh, play this, so I do not Wait, mind. That sounded worse than the first gong. What about this? Boy, yo, 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 boy, yo, yo, boy, yo, yo, huh? What about this? I don't know. What do you want from me, huh? That's super quiet. Okay, apparently it was worse. I know how to make it loud. Uh oh. Okay, here. We I'm sorry, I'm gonging you like five times. Here we go. There, y'all happy? Was that better? Huh? Yeah, That's they liked better. it. Okay, Everyone's good, happy now. Good. I'm glad I could oblige. Yeah, thank you for helping with testing the gong because we needed to. <laughs> it's so rare. <laughs> I didn't know if it were working or not. Yeah, we need we need to we need more gongs here. Actually, uh, I do know that somebody has sent in or was talking to me about sending in games, and he's like, "I'm gonna test you. I'm gonna <laughs> test your patience with I'm, these games because I'm I the only one see... who's gotten gong twice ever. I, this is my second nope. gong. Is am I the only nope. one who's been gong twice? No. Nope. nope. Dang. I've gotten okay. gong twice. Oh, of course you've gotten gong twice. Here's the deal. I got gong twice just... in the same. <laughs> Yeah, Corndan gongs me even if he likes what I'm playing. And even if he's entertained, I, I he's just like... Of time. Yeah, that's fair. He always does. It's just unfair. Well, right. Sharif, thank you so much. I'm glad that you were able to come and show this off. Please bring us more games that I may sure or will. may not have FMVs. I love them. Like, I love this. I'm just sad that it just it couldn't finish. Yep. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. I'm I'm, happy. I'm always happy to do it, and I'll, uh, I'll I'll venture to find more for sure. Well, cool. We'll go ahead and let you go then. Thank you so much, Sharif, and take care. Bye. -bye. Well, everybody, this stream has been brought to you by I don't know. I don't know by what by by the by a gong. Apparently by Gong Tuners Anonymous. Yeah, they're cool. I'm going to run a one minute ad and we will move on to our next game. Tombs and Treasures run by NPC Live. See you in a minute or two. Ah, Corn Dan, that was. Oh, well, he left me. Well, I know an NPC is here. Oh, where is NPC? I don't know. Like, literally right here. Uh, I think I can capture from this screen, okay? So don't worry too much. Uh, I what? should be able to do it. But Is there a problem with my screen? What'd I do? No, it's just, like, even though there's black to the edges... Oh, uh, uh, hold on. Me... I should still be able to do it because you have the oh. title... Well, so much for that. ...area up. No, no, it's fine. It, I literally just did it. You're good. <laughs> okay, you are solid. You are set. How are you doing today? Um, I'm here. <laughs> Same. <laughs> that, 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 is, that is pretty much all I can say is that I am here. I am here what? to... Coo -coo. <laughs> I, I am here to play this RPG for you. Okay, uh, this, this by the way, you have been... What? How did you end up on the show? Things. What What did you do? Well, the chat can't see it quite yet. I don't have it up for them. So I have to ask, how did you end up getting on the show? What did you do in order to get on Don't Make Us Bored and play a game for us? Oh, well, in order to get on the show, all you have to do is fill out a form that should be posted said in the five dollars. Wait, oh, no, oh, that's okay. only if you want to subscribe to the channel and get a bunch of cool emotes. <laughs> yeah, type exclamation point DMUB, OK? And we have the form that pops up. It also has all of the previous shows that we've had, a list of the games that have been gonged, a list of uh, VODs, which I am desperately behind for uh, YouTube, and I will do that this week uh, now that 
I remembered how far behind I am. Uh, but yeah, we need more people to submit. And in fact, uh, if you have never streamed before and want to give it a shot, we make it easy and we're just here to have fun and chat, meet new people, see games that keep us entertained. Seriously, just, just, just if you are even considering it, click that link, okay? Exclamation point DMUB in Twitch chat or in any of the channels in Discord, you'll get that form. Uh, yeah, even... But only the Kusagrani Discord, okay? Don't go to, like, Smites, or don't go to, like, the dis like the official Discord Discord and type that. They won't understand. They won't know what you're talking about. Pretty sure they won't. I don't know. I haven't tried it myself. Maybe we should bribe Nightbot to put that in, like, every channel Nightbot's in. Yeah, Night yeah Nightbot. Yeah! Nightbot devs, if you are watching, I've got five dollars that you can make real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I have a feeling they don't want my money. Uh, NPC, by the way, I'm really glad that you joined us for running, uh... For running Phasmophobia. It's been a lot of fun to have you along for the ride. Well, I did, I finally did, like, training by myself. And even though there's, like, no, nothing to worry about in training, it still freaks me out after everything we've done. I'm, like, trying to use everything just so that I know how to use it. And it's just... <laughs> it is, like, I, I'm going to screw up so much more, but at least I know what the dot projector looks like. And everything else that I assumed was the dots projector was and completely was not. Oh, my God. Yeah, uh, I... We we were it like we're like trying to teach you. Can. It looks like a fragrance can. You like spray it and it's like oh mist my of gosh, garlic it comes kind out of and does a mist of garlic. Yeah, just permeates and like scares the ghost away. That is seriously what it looks like. It does not look like it projects a whole bunch of dots. Are you playing the same game that I am? Because I see the dots. Uh, no, it doesn't yes, look like. I, garlic it's not garlic it's totally a dots projector it, it, it's a garlic mister <laughs> tombs and treasure we have this up on screen this is kind of good music and i don't know what this is at all um, well we'll find the, out well this basic story is that you are basically um the kids you're the kid of this uncle that is exploring an aztec temple and him and his crew have mysteriously disappeared in searching these ruins. And God, you, despite all logic, is going to go and try and find what happened. Okay. Um, this we have D&D at home. Yeah. So this is <laughs> So this is our this is an RPG. Arr. This is totally an RPG. Don't let anybody tell you differently. It's totally not anything else other than an RPG. Uh, okay, okay, it's an RPG. So, I'll, I'll go so ahead I'm and buy it. I'm going to, so I'm going to convince you that it is. So are you ready to go? Yeah, we've got 35 yep. minutes to be convinced. Okay. So we're just going to get started on a new game. So, okay, tell um, me when to start time. Who, who is going to be the boy? Is it going to be Corn Dan or Bersinch? Uh, Corn oh, Dan, go boy. for it. Okay. Okay. But you have to talk with way, like, this music slaps, you have to talk like uh, Fabio if you're going to be the boy. Mm, I can't uh, believe it's not but <laughs> We're not even going to bother with the chat, so. Oh, okay. We're just going to basically go through all the text because it's not worth it. So uh, percent, percent again, I see. Mr. Okay, so. or Mrs. Ia. Yeah, Miss Ia. Okay. That's how it always is. It always cuts off right there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyway. Three, two, one, go. Yeah. Go. Well. Okay, so the secretary's telling us about all the stuff that we don't need to know. But she's telling us that Jose's here. 
So we're gonna grab a few items to help us in our adventure. And we can look at the uh, secretary. She says, what's wrong? Is there something on my face? Uh, coo -coo. Coo -coo. Uh, yeah, there is. Uh, maybe so, you like sp sp drooled. Uh, go ahead. Sorry. So, so this is Jose, and he's basically telling you stuff that you probably would need to know if you're actually going to, you know, take this game seriously. And if I would start not hitting the button prematurely, uh, we could leave. Okay, fine. I won't go that way. I'll go forward. So we have three people. Um, you, Looks like your an RPG. girlfriend. You, your girlfriend, and Jose. Ah, uh, oh, yeah, that's... Jose, the third wheel. So that's the nunnery. We're not going to go in there. Aw. Sorry. We have a nunnery by your... my hometown, like here. But yeah, the thing it's is, haunted. We, we need to start gaining levels. In order, if we're going to kill any of these enemies, we have to gain some levels. So we're going to go into the tomb of the high priest. Yeah. And we're going to go. In, we're going to go onto a low level battle. We do we just say hi to him? It's Scorpo! No, Scorper! That looks like a weird dreams enemy. Oh, jeez. Yay, we killed it. We gained a level. We're now level two. Hi, priest. Yes! So, even though there's nothing here, we're going to change the Jose, and he's going to say it's my chance to help at last, even though we just started this game. So we're going to push this wall, and there's some mysteriously there. It's so we're gonna, We're going to go in there. Uh -oh. We're gonna pick. We're gonna get a couple items here. So where's my take button? Take the mosaic. We're gonna take this mask, and we are done with this area. Yeah, you got it. What does the mask but, do? Uh, it's what's gonna help us level up in a little bit. Ooh. So now we're gonna go to Castillo period pyramid period. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Castillo. Yeah, and that means so we're castle. So, um, yeah, we're going to spend some time grinding some levels here. Castle Pyramid, yeah. So we're going to up against our first enemy. It's Too Beak. Ah! Oh, my too gosh. Beak or not Too Beak, that is the question. Uh, uh, no, it definitely guys... is. Okay, it, this sucker is dodging everything. Oh, well, we died. Well, that was a fun game, wasn't it? That was great. Yeah, that was a fun game. Yep. Uh, yeah, we can. No, we're we're still going. We can do time. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, let's keep going. <laughs> well, I, I mean, we can't we can't keep going. I died. Well, well, you're, then it hit you the suck bird. at fighting. Yeah, you need to I'm hit the bird. I'm an engineer, not a fighter. There we go. To be finally dead. So we gained a level. Woohoo! We're level three now. Yay, good job, Corn Dan. So, we, we need some more items. Because, um, you mm -hmm. know, RPGs, we always need to use to, uh... Oh, wait a sec, we're just looking at that. We're gonna use that uh, tile to open up a magnificent room! <laughs> yeah! I'm actually already convinced this is an RPG. Like, you don't so need I'm... to convince me anymore. Okay, we're gonna smash this tall flask. And we've got a ring, the ring of Itza, which is a very powerful tool. Are you sure it's Itza ring? <laughs> Itza ring! Oh! -ho! Pile uh, of gold. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna move the pile of gold, and we found a red jewel. Why not just get the gold? Because that's not useful. Yeah, that you can fun. sell it and then buy stuff. So we're gonna join this uh, red jewel with the uh, mask. And doesn't that look nice? Aw, cute. So we're gonna go back and we're gonna take a look at um, this flask right here. And we've got a small rod. And I don't didn't mean to do that. Um, so now we're going to, where is, where is my <laughs> stupid? So we're gonna take a look at this little stone box in particular. Oh, wait a sec. Dang it. Come on. This is what happens when you just speed button mash. So we're going to yeah, use that that's mask. Life. And we're going to take a look at everything in that little thing. And it's going to give us little clues on what to do in the future. 
And we have gained okay. a level. We are level four. What? Okay, we that's are level cool. Four. If you do not look into that, you can soft lock the game. Wait, really? I am not yep. joking. You can soft lock the game. So now I'm gonna grab the rest of the items around here. Let me make sure I got everything. Is, it'll Is tell it just you because, you like, if you leave and don't look at it, you can't beat the game? Well, the thing is, it'll keep telling you that there's stuff to do in here, but the looking in that box is the only thing. Okay. But after, after doing that, we have gained another level. We are now at level five. What? We are at level five now. How? Well, I mean, I actually... We've all that stuff. we got all that items. I actually think RPGs need to reward more than just, like, stabbing crabs. Yeah, they reward you for finding the coin. So we're gonna watch this nice mirror. And we have... we have bagpipes in there. So we're gonna take those bagpipes, and we've gained another level! So now I'm we're not gonna completely... The more you say this, the less I believe you. Uh, the golden pipes we're gonna put with a band-aid. And we're going to, alongside join, we're gonna join the red jewel and the sword. And because we have done all of that, we have gained another level. We are at level seven. Can you believe that we are already at level seven? I we are am just advancing. not believing you. Like the more <laughs> you talk, the less I believe this is an RPG. Listen, I have, I have actually taken the time to see what actually gives you a level in this game. I so we're gonna do all of it. We are. Well, I mean, you have to in order to beat the game. You have to do everything in this thing. And so we are going to, because we have gained so many levels, we're going to go into the next enemy. El so we're heading to El Caracol. Yeah. No, I don't want to go anywhere. Fight. So we got, it's Snake Master. Yeah, I like Snake Master. It does say you're level seven. What the crap? Okay. I wasn't, I was not, crap. Dang it, Cordan, stop dying. Cordan, stop dying. I didn't want to be on this planet anymore. Uh, yes, but we need to actually continue the story. This might actually hurt my estimate because dying a lot is really not something that should happen because we're gaining levels. Yeah, Cordan, you leveled up. Yeah, we got to level seven. We should be good to fight. I mean, I did get a bonus recently, so. Ooh. You heard that Cordan is there we go. There we got our master. sugar so daddy now, now. So now we are level yeah. eight. Yeah, level eight. So we're gonna switch to the girl. We're gonna put down this, uh, where is it? Her uh, eyes look a little low orb. on her head. And because, but the thing is, is that she's the only person that knows how to use the, the um, golden pipes. And so, yay, we are going We've caused the light to shoot out, and we're gonna follow Yay. that light. Yeah, you did I know how to play music. Yay, thank you. Okay, uh, so now you, we're quite... I don't know, I'm thinking about going with Jose these days, though. You sure like, about look that? At him. Yeah. He I want is the strongest my... person. Maybe you have to do some, yeah, something like that muscles. actually... Yeah, but yet he refuses to wield the sword, go figure. Well, I also sword. like pacifists. It's your sword. Muscles and pacifism. That is the best. Best combo. So Patrick Swayze? <laughs> I was thinking more so David Hasselhoff, but yeah. Fight El Slug! Fight El Slug! Uh, El Slug? El Slug. Do you, did the developers know what a slug was? <laughs> Well, uh, sure, but that's not just any slug, it's El Slug. El Slug. So, we found this where the sun was shining, so we're gonna punch the ground. And there's a golden globe there, we're gonna pick it up. Oh it my like gosh, it was because of my music, we got a golden globe! Yeah, you should be proud of yourself. Yeah. I think so that's what they give the globes for, right? I don't know. Just I give don't me one anyway. Globes. <laughs> okay. So now we're gonna go back to Air Caracal where we had that uh, globe put. And now um, we are going to. Oh wait, a second, I forgot to say that uh, gained us a level, by the way. Oh. 
grabbing that golden globe got us a level. You know, I felt that was important to say. I feel like stealing an Academy Award is just as valid as winning one. So, same with Golden Globes. Ooh, Silver Globe. Not as prestigious. But hey, you know, I'll take it. So we're going to push that pedestal. We're going to go upstairs. And so this is actually, you know, we're doing a whole bunch of stuff just to gain one level. And so it's not fun, but it's stuff that we have to do. So we're going to put yeah, that. Yeah, it's a level. Yeah, it's a level. It's so important. We're put that, yeah, so we're going to switch oh, to. my award. So we're going to use bagpipes. Oh, wait a sec. Do I have to wait? Hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, there, there we go. <laughs> now we use pipes. Those are not... That's a pan pipe. Like Peter Pan. You know? It's kind oh, of right. Although I would love to, like, at least try playing the bagpipes once in my life. That'd be fun. Oh, we smashed the brick, and we're going to take the sensor inside of it. Oh, What's a sensor? Uh, where you smoke incense. Oh. Yeah. So we're going to take our... <laughs> okay. So we're going to take our uh, golden globe back. We're going to also take the stand back. But now we're going to put back our golden globe. Um, Aww. So now we're going to switch... so perfectly. So we're going to have her use the pipes again. Yeah. Oh, wait a sec. Come on. Yeah, look, the lights. Oh, there we go. So we're going to take a look at this. We're going to smash another block, which this I don't know how we have This is a little intense. We're going to get a pencil. Hey, I am not a weak lady, key. okay? Look, I'm like Rosie, the Riveter. Yeah, that's right. Okay, Bam. so now we're gonna... No, I don't think you are. You're very much not, bro. Sorry. Then how did I break the brick, huh? I'm breaking through walls, breaking through glass I ceilings. Had to, I had to punch the brick. Oh, Fred. Wrong person. So he has, he's going to push that pedestal back. And not so now Rosie we're going the to... the robot. Oh, my gosh. We're going to do one more thing with the Golden Globe and put that right here. What the crap? How many times do we use this? Oh, wait a sec. Hold on. I want to do that again. Hold on. Hold on. Well, just to uh, say that I'm no good here? Yeah. We're going to read We're gonna read it out just so people can, ha uh, you know. Up. Wow, the globe hold fits on. the pet. Yeah. No, 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 hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You're no good, Corn Dan. Here, let me try. Yeah, that's right. See, uh, me and Jose, we're a thing now. Okay, so now we got that going out. We're going to go out because we're done here. And we are at level 10. We what? gained a level. Yep, we gained another level. Okay, I mean, I I don't oh, disagree. I mean, level 11, level 11, my bad. I, I misjudged. But we are at well, level 11, so... Okay, we are never mind. Level. Corn Dan, you're starting to look better than Jose these days. Like, he hasn't gained a single level. So we're going to follow that light. Go. Going to look right here. Okay, we're going to smash another... Round. I'll let you do it this time. Yeah. And there's a head. We're going to take the head. Oh, remember. Remember. Plate, vase, head. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So now we are going to grab some levels really quickly because we need to start gaining a few levels because we have not gained enough levels fast enough. I... Okay. Yeah. I Honestly... I think that if I could this, get this a, a six-pack in a day, I'd be happy. I'd do it. This is a great place for grinding. Oh, no. What was this? It looked like it a cute a little statue. That was a cadaver. Oh, no. Well, I don't... So now we're at now we're at level 12. We're going to take 
This sun necklace. Can we take we the dog? We're now level 13. Okay, 13. Yep. We're gonna grab this. What said it was a cat oh, statue? Oh no, the statue oh, comes no. alive. So we're gonna get the heck out of here. It's a oh, blue cat. Wow. So we're gonna yeah, go we back could have gotten in. a level. No, no, we can't do any more levels just quickly. Okay, so the <laughs> statue's gone. We're gonna take a look at this little oh. hole here. Oh crap! Hold on. Uh oh. Okay, sorry. This is what's Wait. gonna happen. I have to keep waiting. That Jaguar is not gonna attack us, don't worry. But there's oh, he just a certain. Sits there. Yeah, there's a certain time frame that that Jaguar is alive. Okay. So wait, does he starve okay, to death? Go. No, but we're gonna use that. We're gonna use this um, small rod, and we got the key that's in there. Yeah, use um, my. If, okay, go if ahead. If you do not do that, you soft lock the game for not grabbing that. <laughs> because what we're gonna do right now, oh, no, the Jaguar is back. Appeared. You're no good, Corndan. Let me do it for you. Yeah, time to pet dog. No, we're gonna I mean, cat. play the pipes. Aww. It stopped the jaguar, so we're gonna take that jewel finally. Yeah. And because we grabbed that jewel, we're going to join it. Where is it? Where's my join? Join that blue jewel with the sword. We are at level 14. I don't understand do any of this. Okay, and now we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna use this magnetic small rod, put it to the shallow bowl, and we are now level 15. Cool. <laughs> Corndan, <laughs> I don't know how you do it, but you do it. You're getting stronger by doing such things. Yeah. Can you, you know, believe that putting, like making a compass gains a level? Because With I my brains and your brawn, we'll make an excellent team. And Jose is like, he's here. Yeah, he's here. Ball court. So now, oh, the ball is in your court. Okay. Oh no, it's Horn Skull. Ah! Ah! Cor help, Corden! No, don't get hurt. Are we level sixteen so, now? Yep, we're level sixteen. Okay. So let's go forward. Grab this uh, blue block. A door opens, but we're not going to go in. So we're going to go back and leave this place. Are we level 17 now? No, we're not level 17, not yet. So now we are going to... Um, wait a sec, that's... Hold on. To my high priest, my bad. Gotta go left and down. So we're going to go here. We're gonna okay. go Secret to the right. Door. It's the high priest again. We're gonna look at your old skeleton. Aw, don't give up, skeleton. We're gonna move that, and oh, there's a oh. uh, thing. We're gonna use the iron key, and there's a co there's a corridor. Hold on. Ooh. So we're gonna go down there, and we're gonna use that makeshift compass that we made. Okay. And we're gonna take that jewel. See, I'm glad that corn is here. Put I don't it in know the how. Sword? To... No, we, you can't. But the thing is, is if you go into that ball court and you get that jewel, the left side closes and you basically uh, soft lock yourself. How many soft locks are there in this game? Enough. <laughs> so, uh, so we're gonna take. Uh, we're finally gonna take this stone pole and the door shuts. And we are going to go out. And now we're going to go to Castillo Pyramid. Ah. So believe it or not, we have not gained another level yet. I don't After believe that. I'm I know, it's shocking, somewhat isn't surprised, it? yeah. Yeah, we have not gained another level. You know what? This game is actually really charming, despite all of the BS that has appeared. Well, um, let's go forward. Let me do some stuff. The thing is, is that um, 
actually, I can go over this later, but we're gonna put the silver head on the statue. And, uh, entrance appears. We're not gonna go down it just yet, but it's there. And we're gonna use our blue block, and we're going to go downstairs? And we will see that there is a uh. crank. We're gonna go put our stone pole that we... Oh, wait a second, that's silver key. I did it wrong. Hold on. Yeah, stone honestly, pole. I would say that the biggest problem is that maybe there's a lot of moon logic here. Well, I mean, it looks like it because NPC knows everything to do. Yeah. Yeah, you know how to do so everything. One, and it so just... one thing, if you grab that handle, you soft lock the game if you don't um, drain the well. Okay, by soft locking, do you mean... You can keep can playing still... the game, but you can't finish it. What the crap? Yeah, there are many ways that the game will just be like, eh, well, that was fun. That's why I have all the instructions listed right here. So after uh -huh. all of that, we are level 17. Oh, uh, yeah! Wow, good we job, Cornette. We gained another level. But we still need a little bit more strength. We still need a little bit more. So we're going to go to uh, the Well of Paradise. And we are going to wash the uh, Sun Necklace. Ooh. And because of that, we gain two levels! What? By washing yeah. the necklace? Yeah, we washed the necklace. We gained two levels. We are at level 19 now. I need to wash more things, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going to go to the Well of Sacrifice. And um, basically, this is the point of no return. This is the um, this is when Endgame is actually solidified. So if we have everything, we're good to go. And I have everything, so. OK, as soon as you but go in here, there's no leaving. The, the basically everything this sets the motion that is it a skeleton <gasps> is yeah, it I see a whole bunch of bones <laughs> oh, so it's oh, but, oh my gosh spider-man help but we're now we have to use the Akball jewel because the Akball jewel helps oh, yeah. fight stronger enemies okay wow cornhead you've got so much hp yeah, but it doesn't matter. I'm, I'll I'll die. Nope, you lived. You lived. Okay, we're gonna go move this head, and we're gonna go inside. You know what? Pfizer was saying this game conflates basic life tasks with combat expertise, and you know what? So, if you make your bed every morning, you can kill a dragon. So I'm gonna use this mirror to open, use the light to open the door. If you don't do that, and you instead uh, just use the key, you soft lock the game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna use that crystal key. We're just gonna jam it in his face hole? Yep, we're gonna take that. We're gonna get the heck out of here because Poor I don't have Jesus. <laughs> so yeah, if we had not put the head on that statue, uh, that door would be closed, wouldn't be able to leave. So we're gonna take these two flasks, we're gonna look inside the stone box, and there's a leather box that we get. A box inside the box? Yeah. yeah. Whoa. So we're gonna get the heck out of here. And, and now we're gonna hear new music to symbolize. Ooh, action. Oh no, you're only Jose? Oh no. No, you're, this is the main character. Jose was wearing yellow. Oh, okay. Cordan, good luck. I don't yeah, know where we're I gonna am. Go back. We're gonna get our girlfriend and Jose back. Heck yeah. Oh no, Jose is lying on the ground beside the well. <gasps> Jose! But they got her scent! No! I did it best, but I was alone. No. We have to rescue her. Their lair is in the ball court. Okay, we gotta go Cordan, ball court save me. Also, wanna... I feel I find it weird that we don't name Jose. It's just we've got a third just wheel Jose. Jose. You just Jose, yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, you I know, like it. I like it that way, but 
weird. So sorry that we couldn't name Jose. Fine. <laughs> We're gonna go back. But by the way, after getting Jose, we gained two levels, so we're at level 21. Yeah! Good we can job, drink Corbin. now! <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, we're gonna put the um, stone handle down. We're gonna put the stone pole down. We're gonna switch to Jose. And we're going to move the stone handle. And we're gonna go forward. So now, because we got that mask with two eyes, we're gonna. Oh wait a sec. We gotta join. Um, we gotta put both of our jewels inside the mask. Okay. Oh, pretty. Did that give us a level? Uh, no. But we can now. If okay. we now use. If we now use the mask, we can see a white block. Ooh. So let's push that block. Oh, baby. So let's go in here. Okay, there's a tiny little temple there. Oh, no, it's Tez, Tez oh! Cat! Oh, no! no! The Tezmanian okay, so, kitty! So we need to grab... We need to rejoin the uh, jewel with the sword so we can actually kill it. Because otherwise, uh -huh. it will do no damage. Uh-huh. Bye. And look at all this fighting that we're doing. Yay! We fought That's good. Him. So now we are level 23. Yeah! So now we're going to... Um, we're going to use the large flask. Oh no! Jose the guide suddenly turns into a demon! Give oh, me that Jose! flask! It's mine! I don't need to give you any more. I've gotten this far. Ha ha ha! It was my friends who kidnapped Rosette, and I have the ring of Itza. All I need what now a guest. is Sun King, and I will be able to rule forever. I will overthrow Tentacula and become the leader of the Mayans of the Pity, but you are going to die without ever getting to see Tentacula's shrine, and you'll never see Berset ever again. Now hand over that flask. I feel like this might have been one of the most racist plot twists I have seen from the NES. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Oh, wow! Oh. Well, everybody. Yay, Gordon beat up Jose. I mean the monster. Goodbye, Jose. Is percent okay? You fear the worst, but you can't give her up for lost. Yeah, Gordon. Don't you so, dare go back home. So we actually did perfectly, because now we can use the flask at the proper time to shrink down. What's uh, happening? I'm shrinking. So now we're going to use the um, silver key that we have. And the temple shake it is unlocked, so we'll leave this. We will use the um, small flask to get big again. And we will move. It's like Alice. Alice in Wonderland, yeah. Where is the friggin' a oh, temple? There we go. The palace is open, so let's grab that key. Now, yeah. believe it or not, believe it or not, um how far are we right now? Twenty eight minutes? Twenty eight minutes. Okay, I'm gonna go over one thing real quick. Um, this is a game that was originally Azteca to Templo del Sol. This is the objective okay. of the entire game, is to grab this key. After you be get the key, the game is over. Um, all other versions of the game don't have fighting elements. When they made it to the NES, they wanted to add adventure and uh, role-playing and all the other aspects of this game. Okay. So that, is, so that is why everything is the way it is, because there is no fighting or any leveling up in any of the other versions of this game is just huh. tombs and treasures. So we got the sun key. Sun key. <gasps> it's it it's percent. Help me, Corn Dam. Um, help. I am Tetecula, king of the underworld. You are very brave to come here alone, but foolish. You and Percent will now become sacrifices in my honor. Oh, okay. Okay, so we're gonna get both. We're gonna use that Akbal jewel. 
and we're going to use the Ring of Itza for power. Yeah. So, hey, you, you think you can do it, Corey Dan? You think you can do it? No. You're no, level let's 30. Do it anyway. you're, le you're, level, you're level 30 now. We're fully maxed out. Come on, it's an octopus Dracula. Tentacula, take him on. I mean, I do have like 7,000 health. Wow, you're really killing him. Yeah. Hey! You did it! Yay! I did Yay. it! Coo, 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 coo. It's not over yet. Save me. me! Okay, well, you're unconscious, so we have to put down the center. Oh, we have okay. to put in the incense. Just slap me a couple times, it's fine. And we have to use the lighter. I give you permission, Corndit. Like, whatever it takes, okay? Yes, Procent is coming around at last. You managed to break the spell. Procent, Procent. Are you all right? It's me, Corndan. Oh, Corndan, I'm so glad you're safe. Where's Tentacula? Have you defeated him? Here, I'll let you finish, Corndan. No, but I did turn him into dope dealers. <laughs> <laughs> Great, quick, use the sun key to lock this place up forever. Right here, use the key in the hole. <laughs> Better do oh, it. Use the key, use sun key in hole. Watch, watch out! out. The you better get out of here. Now watch this amazing... This way! Yeah. Take my hand. Let's run. We gotta go. Ooh. And because it's Nintendo. Honestly, this is a pretty cool effect for the NES. It's not bad. Oh, by the way, it's time. Sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what time did we have? Uh, well, I just stopped something? at 32.27. I mean, I, I mean, I wasn't seriously speedrunning it or anything. Oh, but you yeah. beat the game. But you did the soft lock. Yeah, there's so many places where you can, you know, just do something and prevent any more progression. And I just don't, I know it's not soft locking, but, you know, it's basically, you know, oh, well, you can't complete the game. But, oh my um, gosh. But yeah, this basically goes over like, you know, oh, the thing my father. Is that, yeah, we basically go back in time to Mayan civilization. And um, one of the things, just because I know we don't have time, we need to get on to the next game. Um, after all the credits run, you get a picture of um, both um, your main character and the girlfriend. And using up, down, left, right, and B, A, you can make their eyes wiggle. <laughs> oh, that's a good effect. Dude. I'm yeah, actually this is... really fascinated by this game. This is pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I mean, maybe it hasn't aged the best, but for the time, this is... I, love, I like this. So you're going to submit it to RPG Limit Break, right? I have. I seriously have. Because, you, you, no joke, I have spent the time figuring out what gives you a level in this game. I have it written down. I have notes for this. And, yeah, I um, noticed. I've yeah, noticed. because it's like, uh, how, how, oh, wait a sec, here we go. Ah. Uh, the end. Wiggle those eyes, baby. I'm trying to. Oh, oh, yeah, I sleepy. Oh, right. no. Come on. Oh, okay. Now it's, I got to wiggle them a little bit because now it's doing all the staff stuff and now it's just gonna, just gonna go through all the staff. Let me wiggle. <laughs> Let me wiggle. Okay. You got to see wiggle, so that's all that matters. Yeah, we saw a little bit of wiggling. Well, sweet. Yeah. I really like this game, and yeah, I, I would say that. Uh, I would also say, um, listen to the soundtrack on you, on YouTube or somewhere, because 
This soundtrack is amazing if you've been listening to it. Yeah, I'm going to have to add some of this to my playlist. Like, this is good music. And the thing is, I grew up with this game. Me and my sisters played it, and they would only let me do the fighting because they were afraid of fighting any of the enemies. And as you can see, it's just completely random when it's going to hit or not. So Did they blame you whenever you lost? No. Oh. But, um... <laughs> I would have. <laughs> oh, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, I think, yeah, that's it for this game then, huh? Yep, that's Tombs and Treasures. I hope Tombs you enjoyed and the, Treasures. I hope you enjoyed all the leveling up I did. I did. Yeah, I got to you, level 30. How awesome was that? That's a high level when it comes to RPGs, I'm not going to lie. Especially for RPG speedruns. Yeah, I mean, and all the all the stuff we had to do in order to get. By the way, in my um, in my uh, notes, I saw uh, when I checked them this morning, it said take gold stank instead of gold stand, and I was like, <laughs> take the stank, take, take the this stank. gold stank. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> well. That is cool. Yeah, I really hope that you run this in other places because it's some it's a game that I've never seen before. It's very easy for me to understand based off of your explanations. I think it's fun. It. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, go back. Yeah, look at, look at the eyes. Yeah, let me turn that music back up as well. Yeah, wink, wink at me. Oh. It's me winking at oh. myself. Hey, you're weak. He's winking at you, bro. Aw, Corn Dan. Mm. I mean, have you seen, bro? <laughs> I, I have lately, yeah. Now, now they're both looking at you slyly. Mm. Oh, they want Very you. Nice. Slightly closed, sleepy eyes. Yeah, I think they're, they okay, need to go to bed. Okay, time <laughs> to sleep. Time to go to sleep, everybody. All right, sleepy time for the two players, everybody. Good night. NPC, thank you so much. I really can't wait to play more Phasmophobia with you. I want to yep. see this game in other places. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Anything else that you've got coming up that people should know about? Um, I was going to ask you this earlier, or earlier, I haven't gotten a chance to. Um, there is going to be a marathon, not this weekend, but next weekend for Lansley Lovely Trans Pop. Um, I don't know what the Twitch channel is, but it's rhythm game based and it's raising money for the Trevor Project. And I Ooh. will be playing American Idol for it. Oh, uh, yeah. So I was going to ask Brasencia if you wanted to join me for that. Uh, I probably could. Uh, yeah, go ahead, hit me up oh. later. We'll go ahead and talk about the details and the timing. Uh, but that is great that you are going to be playing in that. Yeah. So, yeah. Thanks yeah. again for letting me play this. I I love playing this. This was a <laughs> lot of fun. I I actually really like this game. I'm surprised I've never even heard of it. So thank you so much. Oh, not a problem. Right, have a good evening, NPC. Good evening. Bye. 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 Well, Corn Dan, I think that we officially have one more game on the list for tonight. So we can go talk to Time Stalker again, everybody. If you would like to submit and be on the show, type exclamation point DMUB in either Twitch or in our Cusa Grande Discord, and you can submit games or just go and take a look at the previous games that we've had on the show. All right, let's go talk to Time Stalker. Yeah. Hello there, Time Hello. Stalker. Hey, Brasencia, how's it going? Going great. Hello, we just dude. got to see a really cool game, and you know what? You're doing sort of an adventure game as well. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. I really like the NES Shadowgate. I grew up with it. I had a lot of, a lot of fun with it as a kid, loved figuring it out. And wanted to, I like to show it off with people. Like I really have fun, but when you know the game, when you, uh, you know, know what you're doing, going through it, it's kind of a little boring to show off. But I kind of had an idea and it was inspired by my races uh, that I do. Because during April one year, 
I took all three games that were made by Chemco that were these adventure games, and I gave people a list of specific ways to die, and they had to find them during a 90-minute period over three games. Oh, so what wow. I wanted to do yeah, so it was a scavenger hunt for deaths. <laughs> but I, I decided... like dead scavenger hunts. That's mm. cool. Uh, and you know, people had a lot of fun with it. My April races are goofy that way. But uh, I decided for this, I want to do a challenge run. Okay. So my goal is to get as many unique deaths as I can in 30 minutes. Okay. Oh, that's right. You want me to have a counter as well. Uh, yes. Let me go ahead and slip. Where can I put the counter here? Uh, we're just going to put text there. Uh, counter. Bam. Uh, and yeah. I'm going to clarify what I mean by unique deaths real quick. If it is room specific, it counts. Okay. If it is not room specific, you get to do it once. Gotcha. So, for instance, okay. if your torch goes out, that's uh, not room specific. It uh, it does. For the self deaths, I only count one weapon, one torch, and one bottle, and that's all I get for those. So I can't use like four different weapons on myself and kill myself the exact same. Way. Gotcha. Okay, uh, let me go ahead and get this up. There we go. We've got the death counter that I can go ahead and alter as we go. So, yeah, I think I'm really excited. Be sure to tell me when we have a new death because I might miss some. This is a really fun idea, though. <laughs> All right. So, Procentia, if you'll give me a count now. All right. Three, two, one, go. So one of the things, the GVC version of this, which is worse, but one of the things it do, did better was it did hint as to where the first key was. Okay. Which is under the skull. Gotcha. You have to open the skull and there's a key underneath. There we go. Doors open. Let's go. Heck yeah. And the plot of this one was actually kind of silly because you end up going to a castle with no weapons or anything and just you're supposed to defeat a wizard and hope you find a way to do it inside. Well, now, would the wizard even I... let you in if he knows you have weapons? <laughs> Apparently, uh, he just likes to laugh at you. Oh. Now, I do have to pick up some torches because, because every time you die, you lose your torch mostly. Yeah. But we're going to go ahead and do the first death here and take this book and... Oops, it's a trap. Oh, no! It's a trap! It's a trap, everybody! Who would have guessed? And every time you die, you go back to the previous screen. Let's see so how much I can do... Uh, how much I can keep track of this without resetting the timer. <laughs> That's my job. So with that key in hand, we're going to come back here. Yay, the door's open. Oops, I went the wrong way. Oh. And I'm going to do that uh, occasionally just because I'm trying to go fast. That's how it goes. It's cool. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, here's the deal. If you're if you don't want to die, why do you have a sword in your place in your thingy you know in your thingy there's oh. my your dungeon oh no i Death stabbed two. myself yep well don't <laughs> do <stabbed>. that <laughs> okay yeah this looks like a door maze <laughs> Possibly. Oh, there's a shark. Do, 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 do. Yeah, let's go say hi. Oh, no. <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, the shark got Blue us. Died. Oh, well, yeah. Uh, <laughs> sharks are not to be trusted, everybody. They will get you. Uh, 
So the big question is, uh, for me, how do you get that? Possibly you have to have some sort of boat or raft or something, or a long stick to get the key uh, off of the actually, skeleton. It's kind of it's kind of odd how you get that. Okay, what are we doing here? Hitting the rock. Hit it! Pow! Yeah, take that rock. Ooh, red, white, and blue. America's jewels. Yeah, who knew that this castle would hold the secret? I don't like this music. This is telling you your torch is running out, so... This is as good a time in any, as any to... Wait, what are you doing? Using are you burning death. yourself? Yep. Yeah. Oh no! Ah, we're it's dead. a sad thing! <laughs> oh no, we're dead! Well, okay. Yeah, it turns out that... I don't know, hair really doesn't burn as much as people would think unless you put, like, hairspray in it and such. It tends to just sort of, like... What's it called? It chars it. Like it. It doesn't uh, singe. It singes, and it smells really terrible. Yeah. Now I'm gonna skip the death in this room just so I don't have to do that sequence over again. Ah, okay. I'll get it on the way back. Oh no! You're afraid. Don't be afraid. There's skeletons to help. Oh, oh, no. I took the wrong item. Ah, the dragon! It killed you! <laughs> well, there we go. Death number five. Okay, well, you got the shield. Haha! -ha. Stupid dragon. He's got a shield. Now, you can only take a couple of items per time coming in this room. Yeah, your shield, shield gets melts. hot, huh? Yeah, but since that's the same type of death, I'm only going to take the ones I absolutely need. Yeah, oh no, the shield is hot, 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 baby! Now it's rotten meat. Wait, why is the shield rotten meat? I don't know, it smells like rotten meat now. Oh no, what we happened? Died again. Explain! Uh, the the ladder on the uh, going down broke, and I fell. Oh, okay, obviously. Well, we're up to six deaths. We are we are definitely getting plenty of them. Ah, uh, the yeah, mirror, mirror on the wall. In this room. There's one. Oh no! You broke both broke of your both legs! legs. <laughs> and then eventually just died. Well, that's unfortunate. And my favorite death. Space death! <laughs> what? <laughs> the mirror leads to space. <laughs> space! <laughs> the only place where we are safe from communism. And this one, the glass kills me. Well, blood pours from your wounds. That's a little graphic, and I like it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna take the torches in here, just because it's easy enough to get a few. Or uncorrupted by capitalism. Yeah, that's right, Faizo, I forgot that. <clears throat> Splash! Splash! Oh no! There's slime! Ew! Yeah. I bet if you step in it, you die. It yep. dissolves you. I Why? was slimed. Why does slime tend to dissolve in video games? I don't get it. Is this a common thing in the real world? I'm just going to take one of those. They're actually not useful in the game, but uh, they are useful to, for taking you down. Ah, yeah. What? Oh, you caught the mummy on fire! Yeah. Oh, 
you know what? I feel like mummies would be very flammable. Like, I don't understand skeletons being weak to fire, but mummies, yeah, I understand that. What? Oh, I missed the thing. Ha! <laughs> Pow! Pow! Yeah, there we go. Uh oh. Uh, I don't like either of those. Oh no, what's up here? A wraith? Hug him! Hug him! Yeah! Oh, he dead. Oh, Sad. I'm not gonna take my darkness death here because that takes a little bit to do, so... Yeah, that's fair. You've got a cloak. The door is open. Epor. No, I JK. That's an error for a second. It, it, it's rope backwards. It's rope backwards. Don't you know how puzzles work? Okay, there's my last self-inflicted day. Oh no! <laughs> you just. Eight, drink poison. Yep. Not well, I, I know what our everybody. rain message is going to have to be today. It's a sad day that your adventure has to end here, or whatever that. Sad skeleton. You know what? I feel like I feel like if I got to live through eternity oh, as a skeleton, I might like it. Oh, what happened? I forgot. I forgot something. I gotta go get it. Uh oh. I'll get it. It'll. T it won't take me that long. Good. 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 Well, that is fine. Humana. You know, I would dig if you learned spells that ended up. Killing you. Wow. Epor, Epor, Epor! What? You learned the spell Epor. It's rope. Yes. Aha! It worked! So I actually need to go back here because I forgot one thing I had to do. Hi, Mr. Skeleton. I love you. I'm gonna get the, uh, darkness stuff. That's fair. Oh, no! Smash! Wait, you just trip and die? The yep. sad thing that your adventures have ended here. Aww. It's actually perfect that it was in that room, room, though, because I need to be in here. I forgot to get my, uh, key. Ah, uh, yes, of course, spheres on water. That well, makes you perfect examine sense. The sphere, if, if you examine the sphere, it it has a cold coming off of it. Ah, uh, yes. Well, wouldn't that just be, like, useful for iced tea? Like, creating solid ice is pretty impressive. Okay. We're gonna I mean, need I sugar again, again, so I have to take it back. First thing I'm gonna do is put the cloak on. Aha! Use cloak on self. Nice. Now let's actually break the correct mirrors. Yeah! Bam! There's a convenient that there is a full knob behind the glass. And now I'm just gonna Ooh. do something stupid and go into the fire. See, I'm going to go ahead and count that as a self-inflicted death there, too, okay? Well, I mean, it didn't use anything on self, is what I mean. All right, all right. The door's open. Oh, no! It's this guy! Pow! Pow! Well... Ha! <laughs> An eternal sunburn! I like that one. 
Alright. Yeah! Where'd the drake go? Wasn't he behind it's, the door? He isn't anymore because there's no fire to feed it. Oh. You can't trick me! Oh no! No! We're dead again! The troll! <laughs> you didn't pay the troll toll! You gotta play, pay the troll toll! Wait, use spear? Well, yep. So you don't Goodbye. pay him? Nope. Oh, you stab him. You got coins though. Yeah, but he. Yeah, but he you can just stab him. No, oh he, no! He'll take you just it and then jumped throw down you. the well. He'll take it and then throw you into the into the pit anyway. He takes you and throws you into the pit. Wow, what a jerk! Oh, the one-eyed monster, Cyclops. Oh well, okay. The Cyclops just murdered you. That's up to uh, 17 now. Have you ever now. seen this part? Have you ever seen this part, bro? I've never seen this far, no. Okay, so, I think, yeah, you put the stone in the sling. Okay, we're gonna David and Goliath this thing, huh? Exactly, it actually quotes it. You cry out, death to the Philistine. <laughs> oh my gosh. How about death to the Cyclops? Huh? His name is Philistine, come on. <laughs> uh, my name's Phil. Kill Phil! Oh no! <laughs> Into the door. Into the fire we go. Okay, good. Good. Torches lit. We've got enough torches for a while. I shouldn't uh, need to pick up anymore. This music is gross. I don't like <laughs> this. Like, I've never really felt clammy because of a song, but I do now. Ugh. No, I don't want to. Now you have it. a light spell. Do we need torches anymore? Yes, you do, because the light spell doesn't work that way. Mm. Oh. Okay, I do have to take it out of the drawer before I can put it on. Fine. Oh, great, so you're going to become a nerd, huh? Kinda. I oh, mean, I'm okay. always a nerd. Ta! Oh, apparently you can actually glitch to the end screen from this place. Uh... I was not using aware of that. glasses. Okay, interesting. No! Ow! <laughs> well, okay. It's there's a sad another thing one. Your, that your adventures have ended here. Well, again, jumped out the window. That'd be. I'd do it. I'm taking some items because I can't tell what the what will need be needed in one spot so oh perfect the glasses they work <laughs> bellows i think that's the last optional item i should Yeah, I, uh, this game is really pretty cool. Like, I, I know that people, I'm trying to think, because a lot of people have knocked it, knocked it from what I've seen in the past, but it's just because it's ludicrously difficult because you're gonna die over and over. But death's That's not really a game. punishment. It's kind of fun in this. The deaths are part of the fun. Oh no, he just ripped you apart. But that yeah, was I like fun. This. I like this one. I like uninvited. Deja vu's odd. I have but you can, played you can some deja vu. Deja I, vu. I want to beat deja vu. I need to play that sometime. It's got the weirdest plot line, and well, it's the only one that got a sequel. Huh. 
Okay. Oh, I was wrong. I need one more op or two more optional items. There's one here, and there's one in the in the hall entry hall. Okay. Oh, apparently this, this got a sequel. Oh, it did. Oh, well, it's it's got other versions of it, so. What you just did? You just drink yourself to death? It, it's acid. It's not water. <laughs> I mean. If you try and I feel grab like having an item, acid fountain is a little bit risky. Yeah, if you try and grab the item, you just get burns. But if you actually drink it, it kills you. Ta! That's great. But with the gauntlet, I can take that. And then you want to use oh, the flute in this room. Ah, pretty. Oh, there's an nice egg. One. Oh, that was not an egg. Okay, it looked like an egg to me. And it would make sense to have an egg inside a tree, or at least somewhere in a tree, like birds. You know, birds? <laughs> birds have eggs? You just burned the carpet? Oh my gosh! Yeah. Well, you got the key. Okay, that's helpful. Click. Here we go. Okay. Wow, you're just opening so many oh. doors. Uh, you got a mirror. Ooh, you're gonna fight Medusa. Are you just like a uh, Sphinx? That might work. Of course, a riddle. Hundred legs, centipede. Room. Unfortunately, trying to do anything to the Sphinx, it will just send you back a ways, so I it won't, don't... It won't want kill it. you? Did you just no. whop the Sphinx with the broom? No, I showed it the answer to its riddle. Oh, okay. That's why I have to pick up some of the random items, because the riddle changes every time. Ah, I gotcha. Got the rod. Help me! This is the 80s, so there's always a girl locked up. What? It wasn't a girl, it was a wolf. Yep. The sad thing that your adventures ended here. Aha, bait and switch. I love it. It punishes you for playing into the damsel in distress trope. Ha 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 Use arrow on... Oh. It looks so happy to be dead, though. Oh no! Oh, that's not- that's not the smiley face. I'm sorry. It took me a little while to realize where the ear was. <laughs> uh, by, did I count that death? I- I don't know if I did. 22? Ah. Oh no! We're dead! Oh no! I believe it's 23! And if I am mistaken, please correct me, chat! Respawn the stupid thing. Ah, looks so dorky. Oh, it's a hellhound, so we'll use the holy water on it. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, good. It is now gone. Now a holy, holy hound. Yeah, you can have hellhounds. Why can't you have holy hounds, huh? Oh, this dragon's face. Oh, he looks so good. Ah, ah. Ah, uh, there's another death. Okay. 24 from my count. This one is the one that always got me. The star that was on the uh, map, it does this. Okay. <laughs> like, Crash. how do you know? <laughs> adventure uh, game. Uh, yeah, adventure game. Moon logic. I like this song. I have it on my playlist. Too much lightning. Oh no! 
The alligators got you! Why? Why, alligators? I want you to be my allies, alligator. Come on. Big coin, big the coin, yeah. Do, 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 do. It's a balcony. I like the soundtrack I guess. of this game. It's it's really fun. Yeah, there are a few songs in this that I really dislike, but there are some really good ones as well. Aha! The lightning rod. Uh oh. <laughs> hand just reaches up. Or is it a it's fork? It's a fork hand. It's a fork ah. hand. Goodbye, Skelly. I love you. <laughs> okay, now we gotta go all the way back to the entrance. Of course. Yeah, Chad is saying that there's some real pixel hunting in this game, and yeah, that's pretty true. Like, it's not as precise as some games, but it's pretty bad. Oh my gosh, I, I have memories of a Zach McCracken area. Uh, I love Zach McCracken. I do too, but there was one place in there that, like, it was in the dark, and there was a very, very small area that you had to use something on, and yeah, unfortunately, in order the to get snake the light can't on. kill you. What? The snake can't the kill you. Weakest snake in the world. Ah, you just Moses that snake, huh? There are a few biblical references in this, let me just say that. Okay, but now we're gonna run into a problem. Uh... Troll's back. No. The troll toll! Send him again! No, uh, it's unfortunately, the troll I don't have the spear anymore. But... You've got, uh... Humans. Uh, what was that? Oh, you, you made yourself invisible. invisible. Yeah. I mean, you could have paid with a coin. You got big coin. He'll toss you. He'll toss you. Even with big coin? Yep. Yeah. Well, you need the big coin for something else. For Skelly Queen? Skelly Queen, you want my money? Nope. No, not Bitcoin. Big coin. There's a difference. I mean, don't pay, don't pay the, the troll in Bitcoin either. <laughs> I don't think the troll would take Bitcoin. I know, he might be like, hmm, maybe if I hold on to this one day, one day, one day. You know, there's volatility. What happened? Did you just get smushed? Yep. The wow. passage was a trap. <laughs> I love how it says swimming would not be wise, but let's ignore it. Oh no! You're a brave warrior, but stupid! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I mean, it brave. The told you swimming was not a good idea. You are a brave warrior, but stupid. Yeah? I mean, I'm glad that it at least, like, complimented you. Have a way across? You could have just, like, crawled along the edge. Pretty sure. No, but it raised the back thing. Oh. Rawr, yum, yum, yum. Who was that? Who just ate you? I was like the, the Yeti. Ah. Stalagmites surround the room. Mostly, okay, no, have... mostly the bottom of the room. Because that's how stalagmites work. They might hold on to the ceiling, but they don't. Yeah, they might. But they don't. Silver orb. Ooh, ooh. The orb is in the hand. You have the orb. What do you do? What are you going to do with the orb? I would go and put it in the orb. Uh, the orb room. <laughs> oh, they're singing at you. What happened? They woke up because I tried to go between them. Well, and they ripped me to shreds. 
Oh, that's sort of, this is sort of like the, the puzzle with, uh, what's it called? In that one game. Uh, Alone in the Dark. Yeah, that one game. Yeah, you have, except for that, you had to put mirrors up, but this one, you just sort of blind them, huh? Uh-huh. I mean, that works, I guess. Raving Sock Monkey, you're delicious. I don't want to eat a Sock Monkey. Gross. Like eating socks in monkey form. <laughs> oh, look, it's a gong of death. This is what we ring here at Don't Make Us Bored. Did you just jump off the cliff? I just jumped into the water and my armor uh, drug, drug me down to the bottom. That's an important thing to remember. When you wear armor, do not try swimming. Ah! Oh, look! It's Karen! Hi, yep. Karen! Take me, uh, take me. Take me away. I might actually get all the deaths in this game. What? We've got less than a minute left. You are so close. What? You just got lasered. Yep. Oh, no. Well, happens to the best of us. And this is why I picked up more than one gold coin, is because you need to use it again. Yeah, it's... Karen's a little greedy. Uh, use the talisman. Ha ha! Yeah, take that, Karen. You nerd. Uh, I'm not gonna get there with the other. It's okay. It's okay. You can go a little bit over. You're really close. Use blade on the staff. Okay. Yeah! One last step for prosperity. Aha! It's a dragon! It's a ah! Oh no! He's so big! How are you gonna f kill it? How can you kill it? Use staff on... Oops, I, it didn't let me click it. Well, there's the last step. <laughs> ah! No! We're dead. That's and okay, that's okay. Just get the ending. <laughs> yeah, let's get it. Oh, he's drooling. He is so hungry. Yeah, take this, nerd! Bam! Oh, he is so confused. So confused that he eats his friend. Have you ever been so confused he ate your friend? <laughs> well, he has. He grabs the warlock. Is that time, then? Yeah, that's the end of the game. Yay! Goodbye, warlock! Nerd! <laughs> the morning sun it is over. Although exhausted, you lean on the staff of ages and begin your long journey home. You did it! Word of your historic quest has already reached the farthest parts of the land. You are triumphantly greeted as you enter the gates of the royal city of Stormhaven. Moments later, you are ushered into the royal palace where you are greeted by the king. <laughs> I know what thou hast done, brave one. <laughs> the world would be dark forever without thee. <laughs> it takes a minute for it to transition over to the next page. Oh, okay. It's okay, you can look, look at me. You're bestowed a kingdom to rule, and the king's fair daughter's hand? Whoa! How about the wolf lady? I liked her. As you leave the throne room, <laughs> you know that although this quest is over, others await. 
Look, if you marry the wolf lady, you would just drown her. After all, the bards will need new legends to sing of and new tales to tell. The first story's end. And that's the game. Heck yeah! I love this game. This is so much fun to watch. I've never seen the whole thing. And now we have just like a little bit over 30 minutes to complete the game and get every single death. I counted 32 deaths. I might have counted one extra, but I'm not completely sure. <laughs> That's OK. <laughs> uh, I, like, I, if, and if you like this one, I would definitely recommend Uninvited. That's a horror uh, uh, adventure game, which is another fun one to do. Uninvited. I don't yes. want to go in uninvited. Well, but it, but it's but it's got the 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 death lady in the uh in this in the scarlet overgarden dress. Well, okay, I I guess. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but okay. <laughs> oh yeah, Time Stalker. Thank you so much for showing this off. I'm glad that you were able to come. Is there anything that you need to plug that you have coming up that people should know about? Well, tomorrow we are running our first March race for my ra race group. We are going to be doing Streets of Rage 3. Aha. We're doing we're doing beat em ups all this month. So our, we've got Streets of Rage 3, we've got Turtles 3 on the NES, and then we've got another game that's got mystery beat em up. And what channel is that on? Uh, that is on twitch.tv slash timestalker. We, we run the race out of Smite's Discord. Ah, cool. Well, and if y'all want to watch tomorrow, go over there. What time will it start? Uh, it starts at 10 p.m. Eastern. 10 p.m. Eastern. And then on Saturday, we are running uh, a... Uh, our BizHawk Shuffler group is doing what is called their All-Stars. We pulled games from each of the first six swap races, and it's 50 total games. You have to clear 25. Holy cow, that's going to be a little intense, but good luck on that. I'm so we glad that some... people have been having fun with the BizHawk Shuffler. We had someone marathon, marathon it, and they finished it in 49 hours. So. Wow. Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, geez, yeah. Well, have fun with that, then. <laughs> well, thanks All for right. having me on, bro. Yeah, I'm glad that you came. Take care. Now, everybody, Don't Make Us Bored is generally a show that we have on Tuesday evenings. We would love to have you as well. If you would like to submit, type exclamation point DMUB. We will have uh, room for people who want to do speed runs, high score attempts, uh, interesting little showcases like this all deaths run. That was a lot of fun. Casual playthroughs are also welcome. Basically, if you want to stream, and chill with us, chat, and show off a game. As long as we're not bored, we want to see you play it. So, Corn Dan, uh, thank you so much for being here as well. I'm really glad that you're back from vacation. Uh, it does appear that we're likely going to have some Cusa Grande this weekend, so that is going well, to be, be fantastic. Well, there'll be one match this weekend. Yeah, we'll at least a little a bit. Couple. Yeah, otherwise I will be filling more time probably with Phasmophobia because I am addicted to running that game right now. I like it so much. If you would like to support the stream, by the way, feel free to either subscribe, use Twitch Prime, follow, or share with your friends. That is always helpful. And if you've already done one of those, then thank you all so much. Now, it is time for us to go and raid somebody, but who... Maybe Ooh, we've got Fred Coughlin playing A Link to the Past. Looks like, uh, let's see, either that, Oxygen Not Included, Chocobo Racing. You know what? Chocobo Racing. Pete Dorr. He's a good guy. We've rated him a couple times already this week. Liz Star is playing Skies of Arcadia. Chocobo Racing, though. It's got chocobo. You gotta go with chocobo racing. Okay, uh, and either way is good. Uh, you are brave. What what was the message? You are brave. Uh, strong knight, but stupid. What what was the? 
Does anybody know the exact quote for that one? Because I loved it. You are brave. You are brave but stupid. You are right, or brave we... but stupid. Let's see. Uh, I think it was you are brave, knight, but stupid. That's what I'm putting, okay? Go share with Pete Dorr. He will love that. Uh, honestly, Pete's just always a gem to watch. Well, Corn Dan, thank you so much for being here. I guess I'll see you later this week. Yeah? Be All awesome. right. See ya. See ya, see everybody. Ya. Bye. Oh, warrior. Warrior, you can use warrior. Warrior. Not that way. There. Bam. Okay, we're going. Bye, 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 bye. Go. Raid.